Hi, chat. Hello. Dad's just cleaning up. Dad's just cleaning up. We're banning those that aren't human. That's it. You ain't human. Get the fuck out of here. Ladies and gentlemen, programs and users. Welcome. It's Monday. Do you know where your video games are? Hi, Zool. Hi, sportsman. Hello, Casper. Hello, Audi. Yeah, no, fuck that. I'm done. Done. Donezo. If it looks like... Yeah. Are there bots among I mean, it kind of, kind of, kind of, kind of some bots among us. I mean, some of you think I'm a bot amongst all of you, so there is that. You know, that's one of those, sorry. If you're, yo, Thunder, Thunder, hello. Um, just give me a moment. I'm, I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna check a couple more of these because a couple of these uh, seem a little fucking sus right now. And I'm just, I'm tired of the weird sussy bullshit. What if I'm a bot? I already know that you're not. Have confirmed you are in fact not a bot. Uh, I, I was hanging out with you last night, so I know for a fact you are not a bot. <laughs> not a bot. You are in fact a me popsicle. You are a human being. <laughs> uh, oh, let's, let's have uh, this one. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Oh, okay, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Ah. Yeah, you're gone. Bye-bye. Bye now. <laughs> It's one of those, I'm tired, I'm tired. I am tired of seeing some of these names and I know that they are not actually human beings. So it's one of those, you know what? Okay, see this, this, this one, I, okay, this, that one, that, that, that is an actual human being. They have content listed. How about this one? How about this one? Huh? see that I'm gonna I'm gonna say probably not let's have a look here yo chat okay no no that, that is definitely okay there we go no no that that's that's definitely human okay uh looks like we got just humans left just humans left in chat we are all officially meat popsicles for the time being <laughs> you need the sleepers. Wait, what? No, listen. What do you mean I need the sleepers? Wait, what? What? I'm lost. No, it's... Uh, listen, it's... It... <laughs> I have a weekend. I slept. Sometimes, well, I mean, sometimes you do need the sleeps. It's true. Looking at the names you just know, 9 out of 10. That's right. That's pretty much it. Sleep, what's that? Uh, yeah, well, listen, Casper, I listen for those of you who don't know, Casper's going through some stuff. Can we get some can we get some love for Casper in chat right now? He's got some family stuff he's dealing with, and it's No more bots! That's right! Listen, if you're if you're a lurker, I appreciate you. Just just let it be known, I appreciate you. But there are some that have been very questionable. Uh, that I'm like, yo, I don't think this is a person anymore. Hi, Canadian Gamer, how are you? Yeah, see? I, but the thing is, we know you're a human being. We've interacted. There are some names that just randomly show up on my list, and when I go and look at it, it's like, they're, 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 they don't stream. They got this weird little meme thing going on in the background, so technically they're streaming, but they're not. And they don't interact, but they're following like 5,000 channels. Hello? No! You're definitely not a fucking human being. I don't follow five. I barely follow freaking 400 channels. And I've been on this platform since 2015. 
Not as a streamer, mind you, but just in general. And every once in a while, I will, every, every couple of months, I will go through the list and I will be like, okay, has this person streamed in the, like the last six months and they haven't? They're off my list. Fuck them. They're gone. You haven't streamed in the last six months? Goodbye. Yo, GP. Hi. Yeah. How are you? I hope you had a good weekend. How's Anna? Thanks for uh, the 67 month resub. Holy crap, man. Yeah. Who has time A to follow? We working? I kind of figured. I know you guys are busy. You got a lot going on. Yeah, that's the thing. First of all, who the hell has who, who who the hell has time to follow that many channels? You can't watch that amount of content. That's right. Yeah, GP. You know the thing is, is he'll he'll probably he'll probably stop as soon as he hits sixty nine months. He'll stop subscribing. You'll be like, nah, I hit nice nice months. That's it. That's it. Two months out. He goes, I'll get to 69 and I'll quit. I already know the game. I know the game. Game knows game. That's that's the problem. How y'all doing, chat? Hmm? How y'all doing? It's just the thing is, is I, I've okay, so to sort of explain this. I've gotten to a point where I'm seeing people, I'm seeing names in the chat, right? And the names that are showing up in my chat and the actual active number of viewers don't correlate. So I'm like, you know what? I know the people who are actually in chat and active. I know the people who are actually people. And when the number for the viewers matches the amount of names that I see in chat, things are good. And that also includes my moderators. Bot, my bots don't count, so Libations, Bot, Move, Bot, the stream elements, those don't count. They don't count as viewers. They're not viewers, right? They're not watching the stream. They're, 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 they're just, they're, they're there in chat because they are tools or utilities. So it's, I, I've gotten to a point where I'm starting to suss out the names that are actively watching the stream and the names that are like they're they're just like some other channel and it's linking because they're hoping that somebody will click on the name to investigate and then follow even though they're just they're all playing this weird little meme rat ASMR 24 7 well if you're doing a 24 hour a day seven day a week ASMR stream on Twitch there's no human interaction how are you like how how is that a thing well that's what i mean if you see channels where you if you see their follower like their follower count like some of these things some of these and, and it's very insidious some of them have like 16,000 20,000 59,000 and, and i'm looking at it and i'm like but you don't do anything there's nobody here watching you how the fuck do you have like how this is supposed to be live content live live this isn't YouTube. This is live. This isn't VODs. This isn't a video on demand service. This is fucking live. Interaction. So I'm like, yo, uh, sus. Like, I'm on to you. That's right, live. Like, not that I'm going to do it, but if heaven forbid I were to like cut myself while I was doing something, say we were doing like building a model and I cut myself with a freaking knife. I'm bleeding. I'm alive. You guys are going to see that. It, you're going to see. You're also probably going to see me scream like a little bitch, but you know, it is what it is. Anyway, not going to stick around too. We're not going to hang out here too long. I just want to get some bodies in, you know. Uh, I don't, I won't cut myself intentionally. I'm just saying it has happened in the past. Only stream that doesn't show live that I'm good with it. Okay, see, that uh, Bob Ross is, let's let's face it, that, that is no different than watching Bob, Ro Bob on freaking PBS, okay? Well, and I'm the same. I'm the same, Addy. Yeah, I am 100% the same. I will go through my followed li channel list and I will be like, okay, you know what? Like if they haven't streamed in the last six months, you know, I, I unfollow that, that channel. 
With the exception of like growing pain or icing SD because, or businessman PK, because again, I still actively talk to these guys. They do pop in from time to time. I also understand they have very busy work schedules and streaming isn't, you know, life changes. I get that, right? But again, those are people that I know. Like I know these people IRL kind of thing, like totally different kind of situation. But I also, there are names that I know have been in chat that, you know, they, they, they will pop in and they're just, yeah, exactly. They're confirmed human beings. Right. And, and the other thing is I would like to have people. Yeah. Same with Stephen K. Right. I still follow the channel. I'm still a member of Kipperton factory as a, as a team, but he doesn't stream anymore. Right. And I'm still, same thing. I'm still in his discord. Right. Same idea. But yeah, it's like. I, I I don't understand the deployment of like what this bot culture accomplishes on Twitch. Like you're you're not going to be able to automate Twitch content to the point that you can actually actively make money like you can on YouTube. Twitch requires an active live component. It requires interaction with the streamer and the chat. And if you're running trying to run some automat style thing it's just not gonna happen it, it, it doesn't work that way right you you just cannot do that I'm on a place Just found another target. There is no way. And you know what? If somebody who is currently here might get bopped, and you are actually legitimately a human being, you can always put in a ban request, uh, you know, an unban request. And I will actively look at it. Got some great. Oh my. <laughs> so, yeah. So, Zool. Okay. Um, we're going to talk about this actually. Because uh, I feel like I feel like it kind of needs it needs to be touched on. I feel like it needs to be touched on, you know. my sus but I'll leave it I'll leave it all right anyway that, that's enough of that okay so not to sound dumb but what do you what do you look like on those accounts so that I can help? Okay, so all I do is I just bring up the users in chat, I click on the name, then I actually go and look at their page. Like, I'm going to use this as an example. Zero underscore underscore Sophia. Linda, listen, Be listen, 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 you listen, listen, Linda, listen. Hi, Canadian Gamer, hello. So zero underscore underscore Sophia, who I just banned. Relaxing, ear licking ASMR, exclamation sub, exclamation donate. It's just a bunch of sounds in the background being played in a loop for the last 18 hours. There are 98 people watching this and it's just an anime chick. And, but there's no interaction, none. Like absolutely none. And part of it is like 
weirdly there there there's stuff in their chat that is Cyrillic, so Russian. Oh, you know what? No, no, no. Yet, yet, like, and and the funny thing is, is they. Like, uh, like, uh, you know, I don't know. Oh, uh, yeah, Russian. It's it's in Cyrillic. It's in Cyrillic, man. <laughs> I'm like, bruh, bruh. I just. Canadian gamer, how was your weekend? Da, sports fan. Da, previa tovarish. Again. Listen, I understand we've got lurkers. I get that, and I'm fine. Welcome to the wonderful world of Twitch streaming. I've been doing. I've been doing this for eight years. It, 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 this this is the first time that I've had a serious issue with it. English, please. I was using Russian. The only Russian I know. It's just as prevalent over, uh, bots are just as prevalent over on uh, YouTube as they are here, though. Canadian gamer. But yeah, so it's, I, I actually actively look at the account. Um, I look at the page. Oh, no, exactly. There isn't, there isn't a streaming platform out there that doesn't have bots. Even Kick has bots. But Kick also has gambling. So, I mean, what do you do? Uh, but yeah, so... To touch base on what Zool said, she got some really good screenshots of my face for emotes. So let, let's let, let's touch on this because I feel like I feel like this is actually kind of an important thing. We have, and I mean we have a lot. So I still have two slots, open slots, for free ones. So if you're just a follower, you have these, you can use them anywhere on the platform, right? I have two slots open for that. So that is a total of five for free that everybody has access to no matter where they are on the platform. I still have, <laughs> holy shit. This is unbelievable, by the way. Um, I still have 11 open slots for just standard emotes. So if you're subscribed, there are 11 free slots. All right, Casper, that's a good idea. All right, talk soon. And we have 17, 16 open slots for animated emotes. That is 27 emote slots available to us. Now, do you want to know the crazy part? You got your six installed on the weekend? Nice. Did you get a, use, a chance to use them? That's the real question. Did you get a chance to use them? I'll tell you something myself uh, that from my own experience, old Canadian gamer, just manually bind them. Just manually bind them. Don't use his uh, his actual settings file. I didn't. I actually just used the PDF and went in and manually bound them all. It takes some time, but trust me, it is way worth it. It is worth it in the end. Um. So yeah, we have we we technically have a grand total of twenty seven emote slots open that is 11 open slots for just standard emotes and 16 open slots for animated that is actually because of all of you guys by the way now I have this cool little neat thing that shows me unlock progress I have the ability to unlock more emote slots for the channel and more animated slots for the channel and there are goals for that. What wheel do I use for ATS? I use the Fanatec Club Sport 2.5 with a P1 racing wheel. I will make you a recommendation for you, Tuttle. Save your money. Save your money. 
and buy yourself the Moza R5 bundle. Save your money. Do not go with a Logitech. Do not spend any money on Thrustmaster. Just ignore that they even exist. Ignore their existence. They don't exist. Thrustmaster and Logitech do not exist as manufacturers in your world. The only manufacturers, if you're looking at a wheel anymore, that exist in your realm, regardless of price, are Fanatec or Moza. Everything else... Uh, no, it's not that I'm not happy with Fanatec anymore. It's just you can get the Moza, you can get the Moza R5 bundle cheaper than you can get anything from Fanatec right now. And it is a direct drive wheel. It is a five Newton meter direct drive wheel that is just selling like hotcakes right now. Absolutely selling like hotcakes. I don't know. Well, here's the thing though. So. Well, the thing is, though, is that's changed. Uh, a lot of people, it's not that they're out of stock. Uh, no, their wait times have improved. Like, there are people who ordered in the new year who are getting their stuff, like, four, four days to two weeks. Four, four days to two weeks. So you're looking at four to 14 days, depending on where you are in the world. And Fanatec has actually made a statement regarding what happened and why they were having such a problem and now that it's been fixed. So. But yeah, so here's the thing. I can, so I have this neat little bar in my Twitch dashboard that I'm looking at right now. I have to disagree, watch a video yesterday saying there are delays uh, cut. I watched a video from, uh, from random call signs stating exactly the opposite. If you go to the Reddit and read everything that people are actually getting their, getting their stuff. The problem is now is there are people who ordered Black Friday who still haven't got their stuff because their orders have been lost. And that is not actually on Fanatec. And yeah, Random Call Sign is a very good source of information. Here's the thing though. Right? Here's the thing though, is you do realize that the electric motors that Fanatec is making are, are, are is using are manufactured by Sony. Everybody, you guys know that, right? The electric motors that they use for their direct drive wheels are actually manufactured by Sony. The same motors that are being manufactured for Fanatec are being manufactured for Moza. The actual main spindle for the electric motor for both the Fanatec wheel and the Moza wheel is the same. Yeah, Dan Suzuki is a great freaking, if you're looking for anything wheel-based, um, Boosted Media is also a really good source of information regarding uh, some racing gear, some driving gear. Yep. It's the same thing, uh, the, you know, the, 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 the fun people who like to argue over which is better, Xbox or PlayStation? Yet they don't understand that internally the equipment is exactly the same. It's all manufactured by AMD. The only difference is the uh, exclusive game titles and the software, the operating system. The guts are the same. It's all manufactured by AMD, fuckers. <laughs> same manufacturer, guys. Doesn't matter whether you got an Xbox or PlayStation. It's all made by AMD. Y'all can squabble if you want, but... I don't know why you're fighting. <laughs> I'm just like, why y'all fighting? It's the same goddamn machine. One looked, it's just aesthetic looks. It is an aesthetic appeal and a difference in software. Other than that, it is exactly the same. Neither one of them is better than the other, which kills me. Right, from the hardware engineering component of it, it kills me because people will fight tooth and nail over which is better. And I'm like, y'all fighting over nothing. <laughs> it's just like, I don't understand. Why are you fighting? It's all the same shit. Y'all playing on the same goddamn machine. It's just, they look different. 
Now, if you're fighting over the difference between Xbox, PlayStation versus Nintendo, you got a bit of a fight at that point because they Nintendo does not use off the shelf stuff like PlayStation and Xbox does to mass produce. They do their own goddamn thing. Anyway, back to what I was saying. I have unlock progress. I have an actual unlock bar that shows my progress to getting more, more emote slots and more animated slots. So here's the thing you guys need to understand. It is based off of subscri subscription points, subscriber points. So the next unlock for the community is when we hit 240 subscriber points. So that is, and right now we are at 44 subscriber points. We are at 44 subscriber points. So it is unlocking more slots is all based off of subscribers. I'm gonna have to actually, I think. All right, you know what? I am, okay, I'm gonna let you all know this now. The up, I'm updating the prefix for my emotes for the channel emotes. The prefix is just, because it's been cascade, right? As in cascade overload this entire time and I haven't done it. I need to update that. The problem is I don't get to choose my prefix. If I was partnered, I could choose the prefix. Because I'm not partnered, I cannot choose the prefix. So I'm just gonna let you guys know now. So the current prefix for the emotes is that. The new emote prefix is going to be this. So now, if I, hopefully this, hopefully, hopefully, there we go. So now if you want to use the aim, my, my potato aim, right? You just type in the Scots one and then aim, right? So, okay, room is ready for the PC, rainy ethernet, cable to the spare room, nice. Anyway, so the prefix has changed. That's that's on my end. The 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 prefix doesn't have to be included in in any kind of like I know when I do emotes I just have to name it, but I don't have to add the prefix for it, you know what I mean? Anyway. Shit. Who's ready? We're gonna we're gonna get in, we're gonna we're gonna build. Today is uh so in order to continue and start building individual buildings for the blacksmith, for the alchemist, for the hunter, for the farmer, and for the carpenter. Um, they all need tools because I want some of the higher level building materials so things look nice. We have to build a village. I.e. why we are currently sitting here where the stream is named, it takes a village. That's right, it does take a village. Launching, running, install, uh, wait, what? Did it update? Apparently it did. Yay, updates. Yay, updates. Anyway, uh, so we've got some work ahead of us. I have no idea, Tuttle. So I took his bindings file, manually reconfigured it for my setup, changing the JS number for my JS number and the XML file. That's that's super smart. And I gotta say, that is probably something that a lot of people wouldn't even think of doing. I can only imagine the amount of people who wouldn't even think of doing something like that, Canadian Gamer, or not even realize that that's something that they should be doing. 
Um, right, so... Oh, we are definitely... No, we're, we gotta cook that first, okay? We're, 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 we're gonna cook some food here, okay, chat? I'd rather not die of food poisoning. I, I can't honestly tell you, Tuttle. I don't know if, if it, I, I, I thought you were, but I don't know. Yeah, I found out that my config was different for my bindings file, so I saved it, compared the two files, and just did a fine replace on his. Work smarter, not harder, right, Canadian Gamer? Work smarter, not harder. And that is absolutely freaking genius, dude. Okay, so we have Shroud Cores. Wait a minute. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. I have two. I need five Shroud Cores. Okay. Um, I'm pretty sure I can manufacture Shroud Cores now. You, you guys. Okay, can y'all just shut up for a minute here? Let me get in here. All right. Um, Shroud Core. I need Shroud. So one Shroud Core is 10 liquid and 10 spores. Yo, Nick, how you doing? Hope you're well. Good to see you. Okay, um, let's do 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 do. I don't think that's gonna be a problem. Um, right, I think we might be a little low on the shroud liquid though. Hey! That guy needs to shut up. Was looking to buy in this game? Well, hang out and uh, see if it tickles your fancy. How's that? Okay, well that puts us up to four. That now gives us four out of the ten. Or five, I, yeah, so we need one more. Got it. Okay, wait, hold on. Let's strengthen, what do we have to be able to strengthen the flame? I need the, okay, so I have all of the building material, including the sparks. The only thing I don't have is a scavenger matron head. So I need the scavenger matron head. Got it. All right. All right. Well, um, let's do this. Okay. We're going to throw that in there. Uh, heal channel. We're going to throw in there. So we've got, a, like, we've got six sparks. we got plenty of ice bolt fireball if I want to go that route. Uh, I try not to. I'm really not play, uh, planning on playing a caster role in this. I have the components that I could easily do that, but I'm I'm choosing not to. Um, the charcoal, <sighs> actually the scrap metal. We'll throw. Uh, we're gonna throw that in there. Okay, the rest of this. Okay, let's... <laughs> All right, uh, apparently he's gonna be a pain in the ass until I do this, so I'm just gonna move him there. Okay, there, good, done. Jesus. Wow, is that so difficult? <laughs> Goodness, I'm running out of space chat. We are slowly running out of space. Okay, uh, we're gonna do that and put you, you, and you in there because I'm just storing stuff for now. Alchemist ring. I mean, that is a nice ring, but right now, definitely not what I need. Okay. You're all locked in for the day. Okay, they're not allowed, don't chat, don't let them out. Okay, I mean it, I mean it. You cannot let them out. We cannot have them running around. We can't have the shenanigans. It's just, no, cannot, okay? Can't. It's, it's for their, their safety, okay? 
hundred percent for their safety. They they can't be they can't be allowed out. All right, so uh, let's get to where are we headed first? Uh, Egerton Salt Mine, Ancient Vault Farmer, which we've already been. So we need. All right, we're gonna fast travel there. Oh, here we go. Hmm. All right, what do we have? What is... What do I have marked right now? The Alchemist Mortar. The Queen's... Okay, you know what? So, it looks like that... Search the Alchemist Tower. Okay, so we are heading for the Alchemist Tower. All right. All right, here we go. Time to cheese the shit out of this. I love the mechanic in this, so. <laughs> it is so much fun to be able to do this. I mean, let's be, let's be real. These mother truckers, like, these, these mothers were freaking OP. I mean, I'll take the honey. Yes, please. Wait, who's, who's dropping the honey here? That's the real question. We'll be dropping the, like, the... Who's dropping the offerings to the flame? That's the real question. Because I'm not dropping the offerings for the flame. So who 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 be doing this? Know what I mean? All right. So we're on our way to the Alchemist Tower. Uh, what we'll end up doing is I think we're gonna do the Alchemist tower we'll get the mortar first and then we'll backtrack and we'll get the spindle for the uh i do believe if i remember correctly right so we're heading this way but then yeah so we'll grab the the hunter's hand spindle now i had actually considered you know what i think this is how we'll do it we'll do the alchemist we'll do the alchemist mortar first We'll head up, we'll do Reclaim the Wilderness, which is for the farmer. Double back, get Didwin in its building blocks, which is for our, uh, for our carpenter, and then come back down here and finish up with, uh, the spindle, the hunter's spindle. I think that's, that's probably the best plan. So we'll go up and around and come back down. At this point, we're just going to cheese the living hell out of the mechanics. Those wolves down there can suck a giant bag of Richards because I'm not on the menu. Not on the menu, boys. But. Oh, hey, excuse me. Uh, can we? There we go. I was like, I'm a little close. Alright, so I have a sneaking suspicion. Uh am 
I gonna be able to? Ooh, that's. Ooh. Oh, wow, that is. Yikes. Okay. Mm, I don't really want to dig up. But that is where we have to go. So, all right, well, here we go. Whoa, 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 sir. Fucking sir. Uh, sir, excuse me. Can, can, can we stay on the same page? Thank you. This is gonna carve our way uphill here, okay? Until I am confident enough that I'm gonna be able to cheese the hell out of this with the glider. And I, I actively admit that some of this can be cheesed hard. So we're on our way to, to the Alchemist Tower. Uh, we are definitely getting closer, aren't we? Yep. Okay, I think we're almost up where I need to be. Ish. We've got flint in there, so that's nice. All right. Uh, is that? I hope that's not the Alchemist Tower down there. Oh God. Oh God. I do believe that that little bit right there is, in fact, the Alchemist Tower that we we're looking for. Shit. Wouldn't really call, uh, I wouldn't call that a tower as much as it's... Yeah, I love that. Location below. Yes, we figured that out. All right, let's see. Hmm. I love that location reached. Yes, I'm kind of, oh, here we go. Okay, we've got another. Another little uh, shrine here. There we go. Flame shrine. Let's go. Bandage. Flame shrines. A rather adventurous landing, but I'm quite satisfied otherwise. After all, I found a flame shrine. I postulate that the ancients leave behind a spark after they expire. Their light joins the flame and imbues all knowledge collected throughout their lifespan. At times, however, they rest in these shrines, atop cliffs, or amidst faraway caves. What whispers of wisdom are they hiding? Also, does one go down... Get, how does one get down from here? Balthazar. Prayer of the Flame Scroll. Wait, what is this? Prayer of the Flame Scroll, consumable direct use. Plus 20% magic damage, plus one minute time in the shroud, 20 mana cost. Offers a small prayer to the flame that increases your magic damage and the maximum time in the shroud for a short period. Ooh, nice. Uh, let's... Alright, well... That is a rock. We don't care about rocks right now.
And we are now officially in the shroud. Yay. This is gonna be fun. More torn cloth, let's go. Uh, can I... Yeah, we're gonna close the doors because I don't want fucking surprises. Copper... Copper arrows? <gasps> Ooh! Well, at least the flame is, uh, doing its job and finding all the thingies for us. Torn cloth. More loot, more cloth, okay. Plenty of cloth around here, that's for sure. I'm not complaining about that, I'm sure the cloth is going to come in handy. Cloth. Chain lightning. Holy crap. Yes. Yes. Uh, so controller, yes. Key keyboard and mouse, no. <laughs> you would be better off not playing any driving game on PC if all you had was keyboard and mouse. You would be better off saving your money and not buying the game. <laughs> We have a bed here, and oddly, okay, I mean, I'm not gonna say no to the being out of the shroud, because that's... Holy hell, Balthazar! Never enough. My spirit is broken. Can I really blame the people for turning away from my potions in their desperation? Most of my visitors these days are rats and other sad pests. So far, they have not proven to be great lab partners. There must be a better way to clear the shroud to overcome it. Perhaps I should reconsider my efforts. Y you don't need an idea. Just learn to play. Do the tutorial. You don't need to ask me anything. The YouTube is your friend, sir. You don't need to lean on me. Use YouTube. Like everyone else does. I I'm not saying that I'm unwilling to help. I'm just saying, you know. I mean, PC setup? Uh, you... You do realize it just plugs everything in. There there's nothing that you need from me. I guess plug and play. You don't need to you don't need any special skills. If you can build with Lego, you can you could build your own PC at this point. If you know how to build with Lego, you could build a computer. No problem. When I started, that shit did not exist. If you didn't have an engineering degree, you were fucked. But as for setup, it comes pre-set up. You just literally have to just plug it in. Like, there is nothing that you're going to have to worry about. Yeah, exactly. You're buying your pre-built. You don't have anything to worry about. The software is all set up. You just have to plug it in and turn it on. That's all you need to do. Plug it in, turn on. That's it. This was not a good idea. Perhaps such bewildering and unusual implementation for my button causes more issues than anticipated. I thought locking my laboratory door this way would be useful, but my back pain tells me otherwise. Soup besmirches my feathers and my spine aches. This is among my worst ideas. Giant great mace, melee weapon, level 11. Good God. Jeez, that thing's chonky AF. Tuttle, I'm, I, I'll, I'll be honest. I'm, I'm gonna tell you, because I feel like this, this is for your own good. You're overthinking it. You're overthinking, sir. You're overthinking it. You, you, you don't need to overthink anything. Ha! 
Uh, uh, that, that, there you go. You're, you're just, you're overthinking things, sir. Glider. I've always been fond of birds. They weave through the wind so effortlessly to embrace the horizon in these trying times to discover whatever it is you seek. Free of all corruption and spreading beneath such a wondrous journey. Mayhap may ca mankind can conquer the skies through invention. I shall craft a glider and voyage to the hills from here. One way or the other, I'll land among the Blue Jays. Listen, the only way you're gonna mess this up, Tuttle, is if you don't follow the simple instruction and make sure uh, the simple instruction of this. Just make sure when you're plugging things in to double check the connector before you in, in, in like look at the end of the connector, look at the hole it's supposed to go into, and just trust me. And the thing is, you're buying your pre-built. It's gonna come with a thing. If you buy a microwave and you plug it in, are you worried that you're gonna fuck it up? What about a skill saw? Are you worried you're gonna fuck it up? Look at it this way. There you go. Computer is the same thing. Don't worry about it, you're overthinking it. You are overthinking it, sir. <laughs> overthinking it is how you will fuck it up. So don't overthink it. You'll be fine. Uh, we're gonna do that, thank you. Now I can see what the hell I'm doing. Yay. Um, we got anything in here? Nope. I don't know what that bird is, but it's kind of making weird noises. I'm not sure if I should feel comfortable about it or not. Sir, wasn't there a bed in here before? Where, where'd the bed go? Oh god, it's down here. Yeah. Of course. Okay, we're, we're, uh, <clears throat> we're, we're gonna... get the rest of bonus because I don't have the the warmth are you come on are you kidding me right so there's a bunch of stuff making noise outside that I am not wholly comfortable with right now the button as man's mentioned a button but I don't see a button anywhere chat are you seeing a button I don't see a button I'm not seeing a mother trucking button anywhere nowhere no mother trucking button tree cleaned and old people yard mess dragged to street four inch redwood branches star kill uh, star killers must have pulled 50 50 over an inch Wow, damn. Yeah, I knew, I, I, I saw that the weather out your way was uh, pretty freaking insane. Take all of that. Wisp of light, huh? Right. Okay, well, up we go, up we go. 
Where is this goddamn button this man speaks of? A lot of cloth, not seeing a whole lot of anything else though here. Listen, get out of here, you weird little freaking creepy ass spiders. Other than that slider, how are you doing? Spike club, yeah. There was a bad weather spot inland, a tiny one. That was my valley. <laughs> you know, if you gave me scrap, that'd be awesome. I'd be okay with this. But so far... You're not giving me a whole lot of freaking options here. Okay. Let's dig into the goddamn. I already know how to get into the basement. Problem is. Alright, so we got that. So what is this? Alright, so. I thought locking my laboratory door this way would be useful, but my map. Implementation for my button causes more issues than anticipated. Soot besmirches my feathers and my spine aches. Okay, well, let's see if maybe we do this. Hey, chat. See what's in front of us? A mother trucking button! Right in front of my face. Right there. Just bang. Hey. <laughs> So down we go. Okay. Collect. That 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 was that was good. All right. We are again in the shroud. You know, I kind of expected that. Take the salt. Thank you. It's not like the alchemist needs his shit anymore, right? Just break all of this, it don't matter no more. Shroud like I mean, I'll take the shroud liquid, let's go. I can take all of it with you. I'm taking all of it with me. Look at me. Look at me, chat. All of it is going out with me. Okay, so we have the mortar. Now the real issue is, how the fuck do I get out of here? Oh, what is this thing? Are you spy? Spy plants. Chat. Spy plants. Shroud sack? Chat, that's a shroud sack. Oh shit, what? There we go, I was about to say, uh, excuse me, I'm pretty sure I got some ammo here. Would you start that shit with me? Lone thistle, huh? This place looks like ass. This place absolutely looks like ass.
I don't know what we're doing with the sack. Not sure I feel wholly comfortable. I said let it go. I told him to let it go. I said so, didn't I? Family curse would take him. And it did. It wasn't me. It was the curse. It took Wilma over time and now Casper too. I told him, let the sword go. A light, a fight, a flash. And after the scuffle, Casper fell silently onto the ground. I shook him. No response. He rests under the family tree next to Wilma, clutching the cursed thing. I never want to see it again. Well, I see. Apparently that sounds like a whole bunch of terrible bullshit. Nope. I'm getting the fuck out of here as fast as possible. As fast as my feet can get us out of here. As I'm running around, he says as I run around the building. Casper the friendly ghost, pre-ghost. No, that was Casper with a K. As in like uh, D Casper. Oh shit! Woo! Oh, nope. Chat, we're in trouble. I'm in danger. We're in trouble. We are so boned. Uh, we're just gonna close that for a minute. I am just staying here in a not shrouded location. Woo! Uh, that's looking kind of spicy out there, chat. I'm not sure how I feel about that right immediately. Might be, uh, you know, we're gonna, we're gonna hit the old seven and increase that by an extra two minutes because we might need the extra time to get the F out of here. Right, um, okay. Up and above. Do do boop do boop. Do re do re do re the explorer. Aha! Okay, I think I think I think we might have this. Huzzah! Get wrecked, sir. <laughs> All right. Uh. Wow. Um. That is a level 11. We're definitely keeping that. That is a level 11, but I'm not using the giant two-handed beasties, so... Copper arrows, oh, that's kind of nice. Copper poison. We have copper poison and copper. Oh my god. Uh, Scorching Wand, level 7, Apprentice Wand, uh, we're gonna salvage that. Um, the Scorching Wand, that one's an epic, that's a rare. I mean, we've got, you know, the Mana Potion and the Health Potion is nice, the Wisp of Light, okay. The fact that we've got three of those is very impressive. Right, um... Excuse me? Status details. I'm very confused as to what's going on here. Why is it showing me this? I might be getting a rig headset for uh, for it or use my PlayStation one that's also for PC. I'll be honest, I have a bone conduction headset. I haven't used it in eight months. I don't like how it sits. I don't like how it feels and the sound quality. I get better sound quality out of my AKG uh, wired earbuds. I get way better sound out of these things. Ta ten times better sound out of these than I do out of the freaking bone conductor. Yeah, um, when it comes to audio, I'll never use wireless. I don't like wireless. 
I've tried it. I don't like it. I don't enjoy it. I will, I will forever remain tethered with a cable. It's for chat, not for fidelity. E, I even find like talking to people through it, like because it's for. I can use it for the computer, but I can also use it for the phone. But it's terrible. It's terrible. It is uncomfortable. It just sits funny. Well, and that's the thing. Like I can, I can totally do that, and I have no problem with that part of it. Um, so we got the flame shrine. We got the lone thistle. Uh, the Queen's Tomb, we're not touching that. We are not touching the Queen's Tomb. Uh, but we are coming around this way and we're gonna head... Our next location that we're heading to is Reclaim the Wilderness, so we're gonna set that. Um... Yeah, I don't use over-the-ear sets, though. I haven't for a long time. If I'm actually using, uh, using a set. Chamomile? Ooh! Whoa, 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 what the, what the hell's on my head? What is on my head? Oh, God. That is nasty. Oh, that is nasty. Hazelnuts? Chat. We can have nuts on our chin now. Dad can have nuts on his chin. Uh, all right, this is a new tree. We're gonna, um, we're gonna try something, okay? Just hear me out. We're doing experiments. Yeah, we can. Oh, my cartilage. Yeah. Uh, Dad can now ha officially have nuts on his chin. If he so wants. Hardwood? Chat, Dad's got hardwood. Oh, my. Uh, you know, that, that chunk down there is forever lost. Plant fiber, plant... Okay, so this is just plant fiber. Got it. Run. Why, why are we running? Dad just said he's got hardwood, and you guys are all run... Why are y'all running? Don't be running. It's... I cut down a tree, and we got some hardwood. What is the problem here? Why y'all gotta make it weird? Why y'all gotta make it weird, chat? Backpack it. Fuck me. What do you mean it's full? Don't give me that. Oh, well, we got the mortar. We got hardwood. Eh, you know what? We'll just get rid of that. We'll keep the hardwood. Uh, we got the chamomile. We got the hazelnuts. 15 minutes. I wonder if we can have roasted nuts. Like, can we roast a nut? Hardwood. Kimpa. No, we're, we're getting rid of the campfire. We don't need the damn campfire, okay? That's just stupid. Campfire. Uh, we're gonna get rid of that, because we don't need that. We'll get rid of that, because we don't need that. Get rid of the plant fiber, because again, we don't need it. Uh, poison sack. Shroud sack. We got a lot of sacks going on. All the sacks, chat. All the sacks. Chat, sack you. Go sack yourself, chat. Okay. What is this? Flax. Flax seedling. Okay. Well, what does the flax give us? Right ho, another tree. Quickly, James. 
That's the Butt Buster 5000. Butt Buster? I mean, listen, that, that, that sounds like, that sounds like a trip to Taco Bell in a hospital, okay? That, that's what that sounds like. That sounds like a 100% like a, absolute freaking chungus trip. Wood logs, wood logs. Right, okay, so you just gave me a bunch of shit that I don't need. We're gonna get rid of that. Okay, done. So the biggins, give me the hardwood. The little ends, not so much. Uh, I don't think so. Uh, let's do, let's actually do this. Right, uh, let's go over to three. Whoa! Oh! Ow, my head! You know, it is very hard. Ah, god damn it. All right, that's it. Fuck this. I'm done with your shit. What the? All right, well, that one bugged out. So <laughs> we're just going to say F this. Wait. F this, we're out. Range seems OP in this game. Uh, no, range does not OP in this game. Believe me, ranged is definitely not OP in this game. Ranged should be OP in this game. It is not. All right, I was afraid of that. This kind of gives me some like tavern vibes, okay? Oh, shit. Oh. God damn bees. <sighs> Fucking bees. <laughs> Always the goddamn bees, chat. Having to wear sunglasses just to wait, what? The old attitude adjuster. I mean, two knuckle policy? Range. Okay, wait, what do you, wait, wait, what do you mean? Okay, explain. What do you mean light sensitivity? What happened? I like the, uh, turn. Can, can somebody smack the crap out of a slider for being such a smart ass? Listen here, sir. Stop, sir. Stop it. <laughs> post my, oh, post migraine funk. I got it. I got you. So this is definitely was a. Yep. Can confirm. Definitely, uh, definitely was a tavern. All right. Uh, let's see what we can get rid of here. Um. Ah, you know, like. 
Let's salvage that. Okay. Uh, what can we get rid of here? Uh, we're gonna get rid of that. We're gonna get rid of that. We're keeping the hardwood. Uh, we're gonna get rid of the string. We don't need the string. Put that down there. We're keeping the hardwood, though. Right. Light sensitivity plus nausea plus dull headache. Oh, yeah, that is definitely no bueno. Indigo plant. Okay. We seem to be coming up with all sorts of nice herbs here. So this is nice. This is good. So much stuff. What? Forest beat. Excuse me, what? No, Canadian gamer. No. No. Negative, Ghost Rider. Negative. No, I'm not running. Why would I be running? You can run if you choose, but I'm not running. I can say no if I choose. I'm a grown ass adult. I'm capable of making my own damn decisions. Don't think that just because you a little bit older than me that you can influence me to do anything. That's not how this works. I'll say no if I choose. Free will, man! Freedom! Freedom. Hardwood. Hardwood. All the hardwood, chat. Oh yeah, look at look at all my hardwood, chat. All that hard wood right there. Free will is an illusion. Sometimes we wonder if you are... I mean, no, that's just you. Don't, don't generalize and throw everybody else under the bus. That's just you. That's okay. Uncarbon removal estimates by no means feasible. <laughs> Scientists warn, we did it, yep. Yeah. yeah, we did it. We broke the planet. We did it. <sighs> okay, there we go. Slider. I can plant strawberries. I can grow my own strawberries now. Does that mean I'm winning the game? I feel like that means I'm winning. I can plant my own strawberries. We solved the concern for getting that done. I mean, I'll be 70 or 80. It's fine. It's fine. It's weird then. Dinner and a show. There you go. See? <laughs> Dinner and a show, he says. How are we getting further away? Because we're around the ancient vault, that's why. I, I stopped moving towards my objective and started playing around the vault of the farmer, not paying attention, of course, to the path before me. Kids these days, I'm sure we uh, will solve things. That's what we said in the 80s. We've been ready to cure cancer and save the planet for 40 years. Yep, still not even any closer, are we? Let's just face it. The world is burning. It is what it is. And we're just going to have to come along. We're just going to have to come along for the ride. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. Ba do, 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 do. Keep being nice. The people, the amount of people who assume Ukraine will win based on merit, being nice, reality, I mean, I don't assume Ukraine is going to win based on merit.
has nothing to do with that at all. Ukraine, the Ukraine, okay, so using Ukraine as an example, we already have proof just showing that Russia is truly actually weak. It has nothing to do with being good. But everything to do with the fact that they it is it has been a war of attrition and Russia's losing that. Whether they want to admit to it or not, right? They do. Oh, no. Uh, yeah, and that... No, I know. It, it is a stalemate. It is a stalemate. And you're right. Russia does currently has no morals. Zero offs to give. As long as they get what they want, they don't care, right? They don't care how they achieve that. They're just going to do it. Right. Lockpick. Okay. What is that? Twigs. Scrap metal. Hardwood. I'll take the scrap metal. Don't care about that. Alright, well, it's about to get nighttime here, and this is gonna suck. Yeah, we'll take that. I don't care about that. I'm taking all the other good stuff, though. Don't care about that willow crush, huh? Hmm. I mean, we're not in the shroud. So that's good. Did you vote? No. Nope. Well, yeah, that's the other thing too, right? And the whole, well, why would anybody bother voting? Like, it doesn't, it, it doesn't fix anything. Well, not voting doesn't fix anything either. Oh, shit. Whoops. Well, that was unexpected. <laughs> shit, I got shot at. Oh, nope. Nope. No, we're definitely... No, we are not playing this bullshit. Nope. Oh, looks too late. Looks like we are. Looks like we're playing this bullshit. Oh, uh, whoa. Why is my fucking... What the hell happened there? Okay, I, I need bandage. Bandage! Heal me! Okay, that's a little bit better. Woo! But I can see what the hell I'm doing now. Well, what if all I want to do is just groan? I can groan. I'm a groan man. I'm allowed to groan. Isn't that part of being a grown-ass human being? You can groan all you want. Nobody can tell you not to groan. You're not my dad. You can't tell me not to groan. How dare you tell me not to groan? How dare you tell me not to groan? I'm a grown man. I can groan when I want to. You can't tell me otherwise. <laughs> I'm just <laughs> I'm just being a dick. I'm not sure what the actual hell is going on up here, by the way. I don't think I really want to know either. 
It doesn't sound very friendly up here. Folks, if you're just joining us, welcome. I hope you had a great weekend. It is Monday. We're back in an enshrouded. Um, we're currently, so it's saying place the mortar. We already have the mortar and we've gone back to base. We're actually currently on our way up to uh, free the wilderness. So yeah, that's gotta go. Freaking wood logs bullshit. Tori Link Ninja. So that was some weird time to join your live. I mean, is there ever really a good time to join a live stream? <laughs> Let's be real here. Is there ever really truly a good time? <laughs> Welcome on in, Tori. All right, we got some, I mean, we found some strawberries. It's only 30 seconds, so like, I think we can do better. All right, what do we got? We got indigo plant. Pigment. Oh, that's for pigment. Okay, well. We got us some forest beets. Edible root of a forest plant. Not all that sustaining on its own. Maybe it is good as an, ingre an ingredient. Well, probably. Nice snack for the way. The strength takes time to crack its shell. I mean, the plus... That's, that's pretty solid. We're going to get rid of that, though. Okay, we're going to throw that up there. You know what? Uh, let's grab that. That's right, we got hazelnuts. Get that faux chocolate. Hey, 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 hey. You know what? Why don't you just, how about you just stop screaming? You leave my freaking haze, you leave my nuts alone. <gasps> Don't bash. Don't bash my balls, Slider. How dare you? How dare you sit there and talk crap about my balls? Americana, American oil hazelnuts. World War II, World War II outgrowths. Oh my God. Stop busting my balls about the nuts, sir. Tori, how's your Monday? Thanks for stopping in. Hope you're well. Okay, well, uh, are we get- We are actually getting closer to our destination, by the way. Uh, we've got 50 ooh. We are running out of light quickly. Oh, uh, it looks like we are- Yeah, heading that way. Shiza. I need to head the- Uh. Alright, well. All right, Wispy. You're with me, bro. Let's go. <gasps> what is this? Is that a forest beat? Getting all them beats. This game, I am enjoying this game. Um, like I, because I think part of it for me is it feels that niche. I love Valheim. I've modded the hell out of Valheim to play it uh, very similar to an RPG, but this kind of gives me that same niche, but it's got story. It's got some lore to it, right? It actually has some questing and, you know, it doesn't, this one doesn't feel as empty. That's kind of been my biggest thing about Valheim is it feels, feels very empty as a game world. Whereas this, you know, you've got some questing. You've got a lot more people that you can play with. Uh, that being said, though, if anybody is into the RPG style of Valheim and you've been paying attention to King Gathalion and the project that's been going on over there with the Valheim RPG and all the modding. Yeah, the building in this is fantastic. I mean, a hundred. Yeah, here's the thing, though. Valheim isn't actually shallow. It has really good bones, and Valheim really truly isn't that shallow. The problem is, is a lot of people just, they buy it the same idea as Minecraft. Um, it does, so Valheim does have endgame. It is not a complete game either. It is still technically in early access, and Iron Gate is still working on it. They are still adding in other zones. You have boss fights. The building is fantastic, but this just feels a little, even though it's early, early access, it just feels a little richer, right? Okay, uh, you know what? The, uh, that's not gonna work for me. That is not, what, okay, what? Attributes. Yep, yeah, okay, uh, skills. No skill points. Status details. Uh, 
I'm not exactly sure what's happening here, but something seems to be a little off of things. Confused at the moment, my bad. My my brain just went. Uh, pardon me. Keska fuck. Okay. Well, oh. see if we can. You know. You know what I could really use. Uh, other than that mud, because that mud can suck it. Pretty sure that's no. Maybe that is not mud. What in the actual hell is that? And we'll take that beat too. Thank you. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do with the forest beets yet, but we'll do something. Hey, more strawberry? Strawberry. Oh. I didn't appreciate that background noise. That didn't fill me with a whole lot of confidence at the moment. Shh, don't tell Cider we're stealing his strawberries. All of them. We're just cleaning out his entire freaking stash right now, okay? Just don't let him know. Remember, chat, snitches get stitches. We're stealing every last one of them. All of them. All the berries. All the berries are mine. As I'm wandering around in the darkness. Okay, uh, what do we got up here? What do we got? Okay, more, you know, hey, I'll, that's forest beat. Damn, Slider planted an awful lot of freaking berries up here. Oh, well, we got to get rid of that. That's just stone. Uh, that does, stone don't matter. Nope, we're. Get rid of that. Just wand ever I am not wanding everything. No. I can't wand everything, sir. That is not an effective strategy. Because some creatures have resistances, okay? Some things have resistances. Not everything can be wanded. You gotta understand, I'm level 6 and I'm messing around with level 11s, right? So I'm level messing around with stuff that is 5 levels above me right now. Not necessarily the most intelligent life decision, but you know. Oh, but I can't see squat! Wowza! Um, alright, uh, <clears throat> try not to do that too many times. That is a terrible choice. The old, let's do a night jump off a cliff and we can't see what the hell's in front of us kind of terrible, terrible life decision. Absolute. That seems to be the meta. I am very tough. No, the meta is not wand everything. I'm just trying to use everything that is available to me, but again, like currently the wand that I have is doing ice damage, but well, I guess you paid too much for those glasses if you can't see it. I can't see it in the dark, sir. Listen. Excuse me, sir. Can't see squat when I jump off a cliff in this. You explain to me. Canadian gamer. How you jumping when you can't see where you're landing? Does that seem like a wise life decision? Does it seem like a good choice? It seems terrible. No, you don't just jump. That's how you die in. Do you not? You never learn this? Did you never learn this? Did you not ever learn this? I like that. Did you never? You never learned this? Look, it's morning. Holy crap, I might be able to see where we're going. This might be. Uh, all right, so we 
you gotta go that way. Mm -hmm. Now that I can see what the heck we're... Hold on a minute. I'm very, very curious right now. I've been seeing these clumps all over the place. There's stuff here. I'm like, you know... So I says to myself, self, what is this? This looks like a mining node. But for what? Lump of clay. You know what? Clay seems like it could be fired brick at kiln. Clay jug plus six more at carpenter. You know what? That seems pretty freaking decent. We can do clay. Oh, come on. Nope. Don't care about the rock. I just give me the clay. I thought this was mud. Now I'm like, yo, I've been doing this wrong the entire time. All of it. All wrong. It's clay, chat. Look at this. Look at this trove of clay. Give me all the clay. Out of stamina. You didn't know it was clay. Don't give me that crap. It's just a game you know. You know, there there is something to be said about trying not to die in a video game from doing stupid things. To take your time and just enjoy the experience and not try to speed run everything. You didn't know this was clay. Don't give me that crap. I wasn't born yesterday, sir. Where's the fun in that? I don't know. How about like trying to make it through life without dying? Where's the fun in that then? Huh? Explain to me where the fun is in that then, huh? I understand it's a virtual existence. It doesn't mean you just go run around all frivolously. Just, you know, all willy nilly and such. I drive. Not every single day, but I drive. It ain't that bad. You chose to, you chose to live in freaking Arizona. That is your choice. Were you forced there? Were you told you had no other option but to move from Canada to Arizona? Did you choose, did you choose that or were you forced to it? He's like, yes, I would. You still chose. I'm sure it was discussed. It wasn't just one of those y'all willy nilly just went, you know what? My job wants me to move. We're going to move. You weren't told. Mind you, I, I know that can, I know Canadian gamer understands this. You can't tell me you were voluntold. You cannot tell me you were voluntold. Now, uh, can't tell me that. Cause I'm going to say, ah, he's like, yeah. Yeah, we were told either move or lose your job. My backpack's damn. Oh, nope. Nope. We're not dealing with that goddamn stupid plant. No. It's like, sorry. I ah, don't apologize. <laughs> Canadian gamer, I hope you understand. I'm just now giving you a hard time. Why? Because I can. Because that is streamer's prerogative. To give chat a hard time just as much as you guys give me a hard time. Okay. And by the way, if you're new here, I'm not actually salty. Hopefully you guys understand that this is just for entertainment purposes. And not to take my uh, demeanor too seriously. Regardless of what Canadian Gamer says, he's just salty. And that's okay. He's allowed to be salty. I 
I mean, I, I don't. Here's the thing, though, is if you talk to anybody from any part of the world, they always say that um, while they love their, for the most part, love their home, um, they're better off where they are, right? Um, and they all name X amount of biased reasons as to why they feel that they're better off where they are than home. As much as they love home. Uh, whether those those reasons are of a personal nature or they're, um, you know, whether it's personal or religious or political or financial, right? Ah, uh, okay, so uh, I do not like this at all. Okay, uh Hail you okay, let's see if we can make this the shortest amount of time spent in the shroud yet. Ease and thank you. In deadly shroud, oh god. Oh no! No! God damn it! Well, and sometimes that's the thing. So I was not expecting this to be like. Well, at least we don't have too far to go. I guess that's something. Holy crap. Oh, how are we going to get our stuff back? Chat. Oh, man. How in the actual. Shit, are we going to get her? How am I going to get my stuff back? You've got to be kidding me. <sighs> All right. Um, great. That's, that's fantastic. That, that was awesome. Yeah, let's uh, check. No, I jumped. I didn't realize I was jumping into a freaking area that was going to instantaneously freaking end me. We jumped because the shroud, we we were classified, it, it was classified as dangerous shroud. I didn't even know that was a thing. I was fully expecting, hey, you know what? This will be fine. No problem. All three gen is active. This will be a problem. We're just, it's just the shroud. It's not a big deal. Generally, it's not that much of a big deal. Except in this case, it is a big goddamn deal. A shroud can suck a giant bag of freaking Richards. Shroud. Okay, the shroud like we need anyway, so this, this is fine. That weird, really? Just a, hmm, okay. A little bit, that's fine. Just gonna grab all the flax that we can right now. And we're just gonna do this. Gladly take all the clay. Uh, you don't die instantly, but it is very rapid. As in, like, <laughs> you don't have enough time to run out. So I need to rethink my approach there. I mean, quite obviously, there's got to be a way to survive in the in Deadly Shroud. Because otherwise, like, there's stuff down there that you're going to have to be able to complete. So, the real question is, 
what is it going to take? Like, what? Okay, that, we're just gonna get rid of because I don't need any more of that. How much of that do I currently? Yeah, okay, you know. Hey, there we go. Now, the one thing I have actually, I do actually like is this stuff stacks. So the material, the crafting material like this tends to stack above 50. Shiza. Okay, well. Okay, normally it does, but apparently the clay doesn't. Interesting. So the stone does. The wood does. That does not. Good to know. All right. Uh, I'm going to get some more hard hardwood, chat. Hardwood. I think we're going to have to head back and uh, get some stuff repaired. Give me, give me all the hardwood resin. I'll take the resin though too, because I do need that. Resin is a good thing to grab. Those are twigs. Twigs. Yeah. Okay. Fine. Whatever. We'll grab the twigs too. Now twigs is one of those material I don't know because I've never really collected too much in the way of twigs, so. Maybe we can find out if Twiggies will, uh, you know. So yeah, the, uh, the dangerous shroud, you, it is a very short time span in there. Like, you've got less than 30 seconds kind of thing. So unless you're on the very outer edge and can just, like, really quickly escape, you're kind of euchred. As we've already discovered. Oh, wait, hold on. Resin? Yeah, there we go. That's what I was hoping for. Resin. I need a better axe. That's something else, too. Dad needs a better axe. Um... Something about the the uh, the heart. I'm I'm guessing these are very similar to oak trees. They tend to drop a considerable amount more of the resin. So yeah, the uh, the hardwood, like a lot of other things, like a lot of the other crafting materials, like the stone, does seem to stay. Um, I'm guessing it probably stacks at 1,000. Um, let's grab another one of these smaller guys here, really quick. I also think that this might be a good spot to drop a flame altar, believe it or not. So, right, let's grab that there. Um, what do I need? Let's have a quick look. Look, what do we need here? Crafting flame altar, five stone. All right, that. Should be relatively simple to get. Let's have a look. Three. Okay. Um, we need two more. Nope. Just need one more piece of stone out here. Grab that and. Game's like, ah, uh, <laughs> I know what you're gonna do. And we're not gonna let you do it. No, sir, you're not allowed. No, sir, sure aren't. Nope. Hmm. 
Interesting mechanic game. Nope. Getting out of the point. Ah, no. Staying out of the range of that poison. All right, let's look over this way and let's swing this out for a quick moment here. Do, 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 do. Whoa! Shite. Oh, Lord, the poison. The poison can suck. Poison sack. Oh, well. Jesus. Does that mean we just kick that plant in a sack? I feel like that's what that means. So this is where we, yeah, this is where we came in. Last vi visited flame altar. Oh, look at this. Three. Okay, now we can actually, there we go. Beautiful. So this is what we're going to do. Uh, we're going to, that is going to, up here, we're going to place... An altar. Hey, around here. This seems like a good, good cozy spot to just drop this. Uh, but. Actually, I don't need to drop it. Let's craft that. Backpack. Over here. And we're going to do Numero Uno Six. Alright, there we go. Communion with the flame. And now, if I do this... Perfect. Fast travel. So I'm just... I'm, I'm setting these spots up. I'm not going to be building around uh, anything outside of this location here. Everything else is purely just uh, for fast travel purposes. Okay, everything has now been repaired. Thank God for small miracles. Show recipes. Uh. Yeah, dried fur, dried purple berry. Yeah, yeah, okay. Forge. Okay, select, yep. Ah, uh, you know what, we'll, uh, we'll give you, listen, we'll, we'll give you the mortar has been returned. My mortar, you brought it with you. It didn't cause you any trouble, right? Please place it in our base for me, will you? Okay, well, I guess now we might as well, we're already here. We might as well do this. Aha, there we go. We've officially given the man his thing back. Right, Flask of the Fell. Try Survival Flask, Mana Potions, Wisp of Light. Bug Dust, Glow Dust, Resin. All right, Kill Channel, Channel Heal. Chain Heal, ooh, Chain Heal. Okay, we got Grinding Stone, Bug Dust, Glow Dust, Shroud Core. Magical Weapons, Healer Set, Mage Set. Alchemist Apprentice Set. Books. A Mortar. All right. Uh, you know what? We're going to... Oh, I... Oh, God damn it. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Nope. Fair enough. Why? Hold on. Please, please hold. What is this? Go away, Steam! Why? Yeah, I get it. Last of Us is on sale for 53 bucks. Thanks. Games on my- Games on my wish list are on sale. Not a big deal. 
those games are definitely not going to pay the bills. Do, 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 do. Um. I want to check something. Uh, crafting. Wooden arrow. Yeah, I'm not too worried about wooden arrows. We got twigs. We got lots of twigs, but... Excuse me. We need a table saw. I need a table saw to uh, expand my repertoire. You can make one out of saw blades. Big surprise, huh? I used to get saw blades from Thunder or Thornhold before while, you know, hop to it. Recipe unlocked. Medium chest plus three more at Carpenter, huh? My pleasure. All right. Uh, storage. Small magic chest. Medium chest. What do I need for that? Nails, wood planks, metal sheet. Shit. Damn. Do me... Right. How do I get the wood planks? Let me guess. Uh, so... I technically have the material needed to build the kiln. So that's good. Fireplaces. Oh, wow. Damn. So I need the kiln for the fired brick. Oh, that is... God damn, that looks good. Chat, look at this thing. That is freaking beautiful. Polished wooden throne. Sounds like a commode. S seems more like a bathroom. Wooden chair. I mean, listen. Windows. Carved window frame. Ornament, ornamented wooden frame. Oh, clay plat. Holy shit, you can really go all out now. Ooh. Alright, let's, uh, anything better or new or nothing? Nope, nothing. Alright, what about... Ah, zip your lip, bud. Let's see what you got. Arrows. Copper poison arrow. Scrap arrow, flint arrow. Right, how many... So, the flint arrow, I would get 50. Scrap arrow, I would get 50. 10 scraps, 20 tweaks. That's not too bad. We'll meet again. All right, and... Those are... Dexterity... Ooh, vegetable puree. Forest beet, water, and salt. Endurance, chamomile, and water. Plus five health regen, plus two endurance, 35 minutes. Energy. And the popcorn's like, eh, no thanks. Damn. Let seedlings germinate in a safe environment. Well, uh, we've definitely got our work cut out for us. Like, holy crap. Uh, first of all, let's throw the honey in there. Uh, we're gonna throw strawberries in there. Yeah, throw the, throw, you know what? We're gonna eat one more of those. Screw it. I'm gonna eat that, there we go. Uh, we'll throw the flax in there. And the forest beet. Okay. Greater health potion. Greater health potion. I'm gonna throw that in there. These seem like they're gonna be useful for boss fights. Uh, we can get rid of that. Uh, twigs we can throw in there. Um, poison set. We. All right. Uh, definitely gonna need to. Going to need to build. I got currently in my backpack. Do I? I've got hard. Oh, right. Um, let's do. Let's throw the shroud liquid in there. Got the nails. Mana, mana. I don't use mana, so that's not really a massive deal for me. 
Um, we do need that because I want to upgrade that wand so it actually does have some slap. So let's go in here. We're going to go to enhance. There we go. All right, a little bit better. It is now classified as a level 14 weapon, and I'm only level 6. I'll take it. As far as I'm concerned, that is a mother trucking win. Let's go. Okay, I can go down there. Uh, we can throw these cores in here. Spark? Yeah. All right, so fireball 2. That's fireball 1. That is fireball... We're getting into some more, uh, more decent things here. Resin. Okay, there we go. Resin. Uh, we'll throw that back in there. Hmm. You know what? Let's throw the salt and the bone meal together. That just seems to make more sense. Okay, grab that. And let's see. Storage two, nails, wood logs. Okay, because we need another goddamn chest chat. We need another chest. Okay. Mm. So you know what? Let's just. Okay, perfect. Uh, we're just gonna throw that that. That. All of that in there. All right. Um. I wonder. Nope. Can't, okay. Can't cook the nuts. We can't cook the nuts, chat. Chat. Dad can't cook the nuts. I don't know what to tell you. We can't cook the nuts. So. Uh, let's get a little bit more, uh, resource hunting going here. Hey, there we go. Resin. Looks as though we're gonna need some need a bit of resin here. Which I mean that's that's actually perfectly fine too. I don't mind the fact that we're gonna need more resin. Yes, the gable end on that is open. I'm not too concerned about it because this is all going this is all subject to change at this point. This is all one hundred percent subject to change. Right. Uh, that one there should have there it is resin. Okay, we're now up to 40 in there. Nope, that okay, still not late enough for the damn it. God damn it, Bobby. Alright, so explore Westcott, huh? So, I mean, there is a well there. There's the flame sanctum. There's our tombstone. I still don't even know how the hell I'm going to get past that. That's going to be a problem. Because Oswald Anders' chest, Die Wind, Reclaim the Wilderness, that is all over there. The table saw. Wow. Uh, wait a minute. Could we, ooh, that is something I just, just actually uh, contemplated. Really? I'm very surprised about the whole, I bet you can now though, can I? All right, there we go. 
Folks, if you're just joining us, welcome. I'm your host, Scott. This is the Arcade. Happy Monday. Hope you had a great weekend. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for checking things out. I appreciate the heck out of you. Well, uh, so I'll be honest, chat, I gotta say, by the way, uh, Tori Ling Ninja, thank you so much for dropping that follow. Appreciate it. So we started today at 40 subscribers and we're down to 28. Generally, again, I don't try to watch numbers, but stuff like that I kind of pay attention to because that affects my bread and butter. My structure do be feeling weird. What do you mean your structure feel be feeling weird? So yeah, it, it, uh, that's one that I kind of tend to pay a little more from the orthos. It takes some time, but are you, are you feeling a lot better now that you're using those orthotics? The only reason, by the way, the only reason I ever mention anything regarding like subscriptions, subscribers, is because unlike YouTube, subscribers here is how Twitch streamers earn their money to pay their bills. So. Uh, okay, we're gonna fast travel there. Let's, let's, uh, you know, we're gonna, we're gonna rework this. I know it's correcting. Yeah, it takes time. It is a little disconcerting though, isn't it? Um, so we're, yeah, we're gonna head up. Oop. Like, we got any plants over here? All right, we're gonna head this way. Sorry, I was sidetracked playing it. No, that's fine. Listen, you're doing what you're doing. It's all good. You don't see Tuttle. You don't have to apologize for that. Stinging nettle. Oh. Okay, so we have stinging nettle. Very curious to know what that does. So many strawberries, Chad. I don't know if you happen to notice the absolute ridiculous level of strawberries that we're getting. No, it's the other way. Uh, no. No. Followers are followers. Subscribers is how streamers pay for their for, for their bills. But the, we make money from subscribers here on Twitch. That, that's how that works. It's direct donation or tip in this case. Which by the way, I do have to provide text documents or uh, tax documents to CRA for as well because it is part of the income and uh, so bits subscriptions and tips is how twitch streamers make their money no you weren't talking about that you were talking about what direction to go no we're going this way I've changed my mind sir I was talking about both things concurrently okay But I, I, I'll be honest, like, uh, I do appreciate those that have the ability to, to, you know, support the stream through either subscribing or gifting subscriptions or, you know, tips or bits or what have you. I do appreciate it. And I want you guys to know that. Oh, Jesus. Nope. Oh God, no. Nope, we're out. Oh God damn, this is gonna kill me. We're gonna die. Woo. Okay, we didn't die. Where I live, bits are way too expensive, so F them. See, here's the thing though. Um. So the funny thing, uh, something to note for, for everyone, just for the future. Uh, if you subscribe to a channel, remember your subscriptions are regionally priced. And in a lot of cases, especially for a lot of you in, uh, in European countries, your subs actually end up being cheaper when compared to like cheaper than some of us when compared to the American dollar. You technically pay less for your subscription than somebody in the U.S. would. Yeah. 
So subscriptions are regionally priced. Uh, in some cases, bits are actually regionally priced as well, but it does depend on the region. Um, something also to keep in mind and of note is that in most cases, your absolute best way to support your favorite streamers, your favorite content creators, number one, watch the advertisements. We do get paid for that. But number two, if you're not subscribed to a channel, but you want to like you, you want to financially support it support your favorite creator, tip them, tip them like five bucks. Because here's the thing you guys have to understand when you tip a streamer, they get 98% of that. 2% is used as a tracks transaction fee, but they get 98% of that. Whereas right now, if you subscribe to a streamer, it is a 50 50 split streamer only get 50% of that money. Twitch takes the other half. Bits, it's a little weird. If you give a streamer 100 bits, it means that you paid $200 or $2, sorry, because one bit equals $1 US. So in order to get 100 bits, you have to spend $2. So it still ends up being twice the price, right? So if, if you're ever looking to tip um, on most streamers, I, I don't know how it works on mobile, but down in the panels underneath, Usually most streamers will have like a link in their in their bio um, or I do believe I don't know if I still have it or not. I used to have a command specifically for it. Uh, do I have it? I don't think I do. Uh, try exclamation tip in chat exclamation tip sometimes will show it ow oh god oh god oh come on Yeah, there you go. So that is something to, and a lot of streamers will actually have a tip command in their chat. So this is just, I'm just giving you guys, like freely giving you guys this information and just saying, hey, like if you're looking to ever like support some of your favorite content creators, there are other options outside of, um, outside of subscribing or gifting subscriptions, which could be more beneficial a little bit cheaper for you, but more beneficial to uh, to the streamer as well, right? So. Okay, Um. so we died because of an explosion and poison. That was a great combination, by the way. Fan-freaking-tastic. We're going to take all of that. Well, you know what? At least I don't have to worry about the damn plants anymore. They're dead. And uh, there we go. Okay, uh, health regen has been boom done. Giggity. Ah, not what I expected, chat. Poison sack. Poison sack. Oh my God! They have my poisoned sack. They poisoned. Ow! God damn. Another way is to whitelist Twitch and YouTube and in your ad blocker. Uh, I don't know how many of you have noticed, but ad blocking doesn't really work on YouTube anymore. That doesn't really work on YouTube anymore. And you know what? I'm all right with it. I am more than okay with it. Not that I'm going to be making any money off of my YouTube content anytime soon because I have to have a thousand subscribers. Uh, what is it? Uh, 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 plus hours of watch time in a single 365 day calendar. A single year. Which, I'm um, going to be honest, uh, I'm not really pushing super hard for that. Is this Westcott? What is that? Firefly. Uh, I don't think I need more fireflies, but okay. Okay, this is Westcott. Whoa! 
What the fuck is this? Oh, no, I'm not going in the hole. Nope. Nope, we're not going in the goddamn hole, chat. Not going in the hole. Oh, this place. Of course, it's this place. Of course, it's this place. Sheesh. I will gladly take explosives, though. Thank you. I appreciate the opportunity to come into this with explodes. With all the explodes. All the explode explodes. Oh, Jesus. I'm not vibing with the giant spiders and the weird poison. It's just, it's, it's, it's not doing it for me. Okay. Like I ain't no bitch, but I'm a, I'm a be honest. I'm not a fan of freaking bugs. Okay. Not in video games anyway. That's it. That's all. Okay. I mean, all right, fine. I guess. See, I have no problem with spiders. We're totally getting jumped down here. There's a bathroom down here. Weak ass level nines. Uh, we're taking that. Listen, don't judge me because we're taking the the uh, the rat meat, okay? Don't don't judge me. I'll take that, fine. All right, okay. Uh nothing got it check what about the commode nope all right yeah I like that I respect spiders at a distance hmm it's kind of hoping I just hop through the hole in the wall but apparently I'm not allowed to do oh wait 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 I did there Martha's Diary, Entry 2. I awoke to the smell of blood freshly flowing. I looked outside my window. Oh! What the fuck was that? Excuse me, sir. Wow, the aggro is real. Shit. Jesus. How's he? You know what? Doesn't matter how he's doing it. The point is, he is doing it. Ow! Where are. Oh, you dirty bitch. Huh. Alright. I, I got you, ass. I'm done with your bullshit. F, sir. Seems like he was just breaking a whole bunch of shit outside. Couldn't open the door, huh? Couldn't just open the door. A yeah, normal human being. No. Couldn't do that. Nope. 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 Incapable. I 
Absolutely incapable. <laughs> I like that. I respect spiders at a distance. Shit. Oh, oh, there we go. Okay. Shroud liquid? Sure, we'll take that. Uh, let's, let's try to read this again. I awoke to the smell of blood freshly flowing. I looked outside my window where some predator had made a fresh kill of two fey deer. Effortless, maybe, but certainly not painless. At first, I cried out in shock, but then the realization hit me. Two fey deer, eight rib portions, maybe ten. Twelve sausages. Blood pudding is dessert. Gallons of stew. This will feed the whole village. Thank the ancients. You're booking off Thursday afternoon? Does that mean what I think it means? Does this mean I can announce something then? That means that Zaul is going to be joining us in Valheim on Thursday, chat. <laughs> Are you guys ready for another co-op stream? And the shenanigans that shall ensue? That means that we have to do some more work tomorrow because I got to finish the new building. I got to, I have to finish the new building then. That's all there is to it. All right, Martha's Diary, entry one. Still nothing to eat, still nothing to serve. Bones, scraps, and watery soup. When will we meet our demise? A new traveler arrived, hungry and tired. She wanted me to leave the bones in her stew. A quiet anger lingered in her eyes, wild determination like a starving wolf. I offered her a room. She declined, declined with a grunt, marched into the woods up north to sleep on the cold hard ground. A brute, she belongs in the wild anyhow. Really? Wow. Listen, Martha, you sound like a real freaking see you next Tuesday kind of person. Forest Longbow, level nine, uncommon. Well, we'll take that, but we're breaking that down because we don't need it. I'm gonna come in here, we're gonna grab that. We're going to salvage that. Because why not? Uh, we're gonna get rid of that though, because that's trash and you know. we'll get rid of the fireflies. We don't need those. Uh, Right, so we do need the, the critter parts are actually useful, so we're gonna stick on uh, hold on to those for the time being. Hmm. I like the fact that I can't manually freaking aim the bow, by the way. That's right, chat. We can manually aim the bow. It is a thing. We can we can manually aim it. Okay. Can confirm. Can a manually aim bow. Oh. Too heavily on the uh, Yule range there. I mean, I get it, Broski. Range, ranged is uh, GG easy, right? Okay, so we've checked that one and that one. Right. Okay. The hunter didn't stay at the inn in Westcott. She avoids human contact. Instead, she must have set up camp close by. Her hand spindle cannot be far. What is 
Aurelian flower. Okay. We're going to take the, the wood for now, but... Close to powder ball, let's go. Who doesn't love an exploding ball? Can we get my camera up this way? I think we can try for that, yes. So would you would you like it? Okay, so here's the question, chat. I'm gonna run this by you guys too as an idea. So the idea is, is for Zool to have her camera up on my stream and on my and my camera at the same time. Or are you thinking for you to stream it while we're in just multi-stream? I guess the best question would be, how about I ask instead of assume? That way, I don't make ass at the... You're not going to stream. Okay, so... We're gonna, so here, here's the plan then. We'll, we're, we're, we'll try to get her camera up um, on the stream so we're both on the screen at the same time. Not until you get another camera? Oh, you don't think the, your webcam's pretty good though. Your webcam's pretty, uh, pretty, pretty dope, though. It's, it's pretty good. The webcam built into your, uh, laptop's pretty good, you know. What in the sand hill is that crap in the mid- What is that? No, it don't matter. No matter what it is. It doesn't matter. Yeah. Yeah. Uh. Uh. You've got two, because you've got the one, yeah, you got the one, the, the laptop one, and then I don't think you, you wouldn't really actually need three, believe it or not. Should be alright with just two. Ow! Get wrecked, nerd, give me your stuff. <laughs> okay, it's okay. I'm not gonna, f you know, I'm not gonna tell you you have to. That's not how I roll. It's not how. That's not how we roll around here. We don't force humans into doing things. We kindly ask them, but we don't force them. You know what I mean? Forty meters, huh? All right, where the hell is this? I saw there's a wolf out here so I a see you over here. Uh-huh. Your soul is mine. All right. Uh this looks to be her camp. Look like that, right? Abandoned hunter. Oh god, damn it. Jesus, bee, bees. It's always the freaking bees, man. Always the goddamn bees. Leave the rot behind. Finally, fresh air. Not heavy with the scent of pollen or sweet sickening decay. My head spins. I haven't slept in days. Not since I left my spindle in the, re in the revel wood atop that cliffside. So far away now. But I can't turn back. I had to flee. Something sinister is buried in that thicket. Spreads through the undergrowth like roots. It embraces and entangles, squeezes and suffocates, shimmering in the darkness, between the branches, under the skin, the silky web of a two-clawed hunting spider. Nightmares like these are forged by man, I've learned. Execution is X! Level nine. All right, well, we're still not gonna use the Executioner's X level nine because F that. We're gonna grab this though. Yeah, buddy. All right. We yeah, we can talk about it. It's all good. 
We got it. Don't worry. So yes, chat. Zool is going to be joining us back on the stream. We're just going to get rid of that because we don't need it. Reach the Revelwood. Oh my god, where do I have to go now? So that's the abandoned hunter camp. That's Westcott. Oh, please tell me that is not the Revelwood. Wither encampment, cave entrance. Ooh. Where is the Revelwood? Table saw. Oy. Story of rot, flame shrine. Oh, come on, please. Okay, well, hold on. We've got two skill points, though. So we're going to unlock Mason. I... So the reason I had to do that is because I really want the quality gear. Also, um... Dexterity, dexterity. Pressing the jump up. What? Okay, so there's apparently a double jump in here somewhere. Power parry. Backstab damage. Well rested. Lumberjack. I am not seeing it. Where in the hell is the double jump? Blink. Radiant aura. Be gone! Updraft. Eagle Eye, Shell Shock, Beasting, Multi Shot, Double Jump. We need four points to unlock Double Jump? God damn. Oh, oh why would you have. Why, why? Carbon fiber is not really all that great, honestly. Uh. Fiber really isn't all that great. Oh, this is flint. Oh, at least not for everything. It's great in the automotive industry, but you don't need it for everything. It's terrible for everything. Not everything needs to be carbon fiber. Chat. Exactly, right? See? Exactly. We've moved to graphene. I wonder because I have hazelnuts if I can make nut butter. All that nut butters. I feel as though this is probably One moment, please. game sir I know I can't real life I meant in the game So there are stairs here. We are going down. Once you pop, you just can't stop. <laughs> Shh. And we're going to delete that. 
that. We're gonna keep that. We'll keep the stone for now. Eh, we'll get rid of the stone. I've got 2,000. Right. Flint we're keeping. Right. Okay. Uh, that doesn't have nearly enough glow to it. So let's do this. We're going to drop that into there. Boom. Done. Okay. Now I can see what the hell we're doing. So you know what? No. Nope. We're... Somewhere around here. Is the abandoned? There we go. Okay. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do this. Do I have, uh, actually, I don't think I have anything to cook, do I? Ah, I do. Beautiful. Perfect. Okay, we do have something to cook. Right, so. Oh, dear God. I just gave myself food poisoning. Americanos and hazelnuts are one of those history things I find so fun. Like that, you can't pop them. I mean, I get that, I can't pop them, but still, sir. All right. As the food poisoning just keeps ticking down. Tick tock, tick tock. Okay, uh, can we, can we, can we, there we go. <laughs> Jeez. What'd you do? I gave myself food poisoning. Why'd you do that? I didn't mean to, it just happened. Oop. Okay, so I'm just gonna, yep. Okay, uh, I'm sure that there's a purpose to this as to why it goes down and all of that. You know what? Let's just have a quick look. I want to see what's actually down here. I'm 100% legitimately curious now. Like, bro, what is this? Um... Huh. Really? Really? Alright, that's fair. Never mind. Never mind. Alright, let's go. Let's go see if we can find this goddamn spindle. Reach the Revel Wood, it says. Alright, so whatever the Revel Wood is, we're heading to it. Got more than enough of those damn mushrooms right now. Look at all the, look at all the mutton. Okay, where? Okay, so that's the abandoned hunter camp. Withered encampment. No, died. Okay, you know what? We're we're gonna we're gonna attempt for a little bit of. The Overland Express here, chat. As you can see, the Overland Express is just, we're just uh, hippity hopping and all the way, uh, you know, hippity hoppity get off my property kind of deal. Hey, wow, that got real bright real fast. Holy crap. Uh, no, that plant can go and fuck itself. Uh, 
You know what? I'm gonna beat the shit out of the plant. This crap off my head. On the treadmill for a bit. That's because Casper's currently running just as fast as we can. Holding onto one another's hand. Jesus, what is that? That looks like a freaking... What the fuck is that thing? It's like a crab. What is that thing? on earth holy goddamn what are you i don't you know what no i ain't even we ain't even sticking around i don't want to know anymore i don't want to know anymore nope no no you can just stay down at the bottom of the goddamn hill i want no part of your bullshittery i don't know what that was but i don't want to know what it was either the old stinging nettle Hey, let's get some more of that. There we go. Um. <gasps> One moment, please. What is this? Copper ore. What did we just... We just found copper. Let's freaking go, bud. I will definitely take this into... Yes, please. Um, drink. Dom. Dom. So, copper ore. We'll get rid of the bones. We got more than enough of those. We don't need any of them. We're good. Right. Oh, good lord. Um. Died when it... So we've got to make that the, the cave. All right, let's go to the journal here. Let's see what we've got. Um, the hunter traveled through Revelwood to reach Westcott. Her hand spindle was left in a different camp. All right, so if we go to the map. Okay, so need the spindle. As we're just gonna harvest a bun whole bun Ooh, hey, we'll grab some more beets too, why not? Beets are fine, you know. We make some vegetable soup. Right, 
Okay, uh... Oh, can we... Alright, looks like... Oh, Jesus! I don't know what that was, but it sure in the hell wasn't friendly. Okay, that could complicate. Oh, wait, what? What did we just... Chat, what did we just find? I'm trying to figure out dinner at the moment as well. Probably not a terrible idea. Okay, this looks like... A good spot to be a lookout, that's damn sure. Sous vide, lots of chicken, then freeze it off, eat forever. Well, not everybody likes that much chicken, sir. Not everyone likes to eat chicken all the time. No, I know. <laughs> Just got dip. Really? Really? Sir? Really? I think we may be at a bit of an impasse here, chat. Yes, yes, we're, we're, uh, certainly at a bit of a minute. Oh, that's, oh, here we go. Can, can, can we... Let's go, come on, baby. Woo! That landing, though. Chicken Club is a sandwich name. Do da do da <laughs> Literal micro nut pick. <laughs> I eat forever. Unless at once. I didn't say do every chicken. What if people don't like eating chicken? Those people exist. I sealed some in a little mason, uh, in, in, in with a little lemon thyme. Couple plain. Really? Actually sounds pretty. Purse? What the fuck is that thing? No. Oh, no. Whoa. Ow. Whoa, 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 sir. I don't know what you are. I don't care. Nope. Here, piggy, piggy, piggy. All these things are not, uh, they're not very, yeah. Range is definitely not OP in this case. These things are barely taking any damage. Come on, Peggy. I didn't bake it. Bake it. Exactly. Holy crap, we got one dead. Can I kill the other one? Hey. Don't resist it. What do you mean resist? Oh. I bet you it's because it's frost magic. I bet you if this thing was fire, it'd be like freaking, they'd be like barbecue. Oh, baby, let's go. Oh, uh, we gonna be cooking up some tender vittles later. Mm-hmm. All right, so what the frack is this, though? Oh, listen, sir. Get wrecked. Oh shit! Jesus Christ! 
an underground home. Oh, we are totally cooking. We're totally cooking up that boar meat, by the way. Holy hell yes. Let's freaking go. Oh, come on. Let's go. Let's go. This is a big chunk of meat, by the way. Okay. Out of there. Yes. Right, so we I want to see what this does. Plus three constant. Wow. Only 10 minutes though? Really? Only 10 minutes for that. Did I get 20? Well, we're just okay. That's that. You know what? That's fine. That's fine. Fair. 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 Maximum stamina increased. Okay, let's go. Uh, yeah. Uh, so I guess this means that I definitely need to keep my eyes open. Uh, for all kinds of wonderful, beautiful creatures and denizens of, of, you know, of the forest here, because... Uh... Azurusla. Okay, um... Where's the per patch? Okay, we're gonna get rid of that. Throw that up there. Gonna get rid of the fur patch. Uh, this kinda looks odd. Food poisoning. Oh, should be cooked before eating. Good to know. Um, looks a little oddly like um, penis. It's gonna. I'm, I'm just, listen, I'm, I'm just going to be honest about it. It looks like a penis. Well, this seems to work well. Undergrowth staff. Holy shit. It's only a level two, but still. It's kind of an OP level two. Right. Um. Yo, Pinkfield, gotta love that. So, right? Exactly. It's very appetizing. Looks like a uh, oh, big old freaking bag of dongus. What do we got here? Mana leech. Precise, precise, precise. Staff that absorbs energy from the soil. It's brimming with potential. You know what? We're just going to get rid of that because that's not something we're going to use. Pink Fail, hello. How are you? Radio. Bag of Dongus. Yeah, ba big old bag of Dongus. You heard me. I said it. Bag of Dongus. Dexterity for 15. Um. That's right. Okay. What else? Hey. There we go. Now I can see what the... Take the chain lightning as well and the extra bandage. Thank you. You know, it makes a big difference when you can see what the heck you're doing down here. We'll pick that too. Why not? Uh, I don't think so. Nope. 
Is there a way out of this place? Sure should be. Ah, oh, come on. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, chat. Oh, we're in trouble. Actually, hold on. Let's see if we can physics the hell out. Nope, maybe not. Mmm. Nope. We are definitely in trouble now. Sheet. Yeah, the staff is actually very pretty, but it's kind of useless considering, like, I've got the warrior build going, so. Okay, there we go. Oh, thank God. I was like, oh, this is going to be a problem, isn't it? You know, it'd be nice if I could kill that. What is it? Copper. All right. Well, we found a copper mine, so there's that. It kind of has some light. I prefer the term mystery meat stuffed in... That's just sausage. Okay. Actually, no, that's not even sausage. That's hot dogs. What? You know what? No, I don't care what that is. We're not... More copper. There's so much copper up here. Holy crap. So much copper. It's all the copper. Haggis, yeah. Haggis, there you go. Mystery meat stuffed in a lamb stomach. Great supply of intestines. That's stomach. Hey, hey. Oh, shit. Where? 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 Where are? Oh, you know what? Doesn't matter where. Oh come on! What the hell was that? Oh, that was some BS. Uh, well, at least I'm back in Westcott, but still, that's some bullshit. to God. Ah. Player in my uh, youngest daughter's uh, terminology, uh, <laughs> get flayed. Get flayed. Oh yeah, we're gonna stick to the path. Four minutes. Much of, how much of the stuff to everything except for the food. All the edible goodies are still here. Another oh, trucker. Of course it is. Okay, that's yeah. Buffed up. Buffed. Let's, uh, let's see if we can go retrieve my stuff again. That's three deaths today. The uh, Friday, not a single death. Not a problem. Today, three. Three. Three deaths. Three times we've died. Oh, really, oh, really impressed so far, I'm going to say. This path is not taking me where I want to go. So we're going to have to, uh... All right. Looks like we're going a little, uh, off the beaten path here. We're going to do what we were doing before. I'm going to cheese the living shit out of it. some of the uh, Skyrim style climb mechanics as you can see which uh, we've we've so adequately uh, we've mastered the climb mechanics okay that's that's all there is to it 
I don't need the flame. No. No. Oh, shit. Those are bees. God damn it. Actually, no. No. God damn it, Bobby. Freaking bees, man. I didn't want nothing. Nothing. Didn't have to come at me. I had no beef with you. The bees just had to start some shit. Waiting on the neighbor's tree. Oh, whoa, whoa, nope. Nope. Oh, we're we're out. Nope. Bye. Nope. Totally, totally bye. Another 50, then complete 100. One, one hundred. Ah, 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 ah. Is this where I, yeah, so this is where I decided that uh, it was better to go around. So we went around, right? Excuse me, could you, thank you for climbing. Hey, uh, we're, we're, Ah, oh, shit. Okay, you know what? Before we end up getting filled up on a bunch of garbage I don't need. Harvest. I can make some veggie soup, okay? I don't want to hear any kind of judgy, judginess coming at anybody. Dad is going to attempt to make some veggie soup when we get back to camp. Right now, oh, that's that is clay. Okay, so mm, can I can I cheese this? What do you think, chat? Oh no. Nope. Okay, apparently not. No, nope, can't cheese it that way. Yeah, I'm, I don't, so, eh, doesn't matter. It did, it, you know what, it did exactly what it needed to do, and that was, as far as I'm concerned, Pal World did exactly what it needed to do, and that was to disrupt, uh, Nintendo and Pokemon's hold on that kind of game, that, that gameplay style, you know what I mean? It did exactly what it set out to do. it oversold though because everybody who's played it who who's who's played it has loved it like for me again it's one of those like it's not myself a game that I would play just because I'm not into that kind of game but oh no 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 oh no we're we're good we're good at least I think we are shit Oh no! Oh, almost weren't. You know what? I don't think I want to know what those are. We're not going to stick around. No! I'm not. Nope. Bye. Bye! Sure not sticking around. <laughs> Sure not happening. No, sir. We're not sticking around for you to, uh, you know, play your, play your tricks on me. I want to get it back up. Ooh, there's one of them asshole plants. Oh, two of the asshole plants. Okay, awesome. Listen, foliage is not supposed to be dangerous like this. What the hell? I missed the Karazhan Theater Bot. Okay, Karazhan was an amazing raid in, like, raid overall. Karazhan was a lot of fun. Plus, Pokemon does not have... Well, I mean, and that's the thing. Like, again, I have enjoyed watching other people play Pal World. I have nothing against the game. Just like I don't have anything against Pokemon. I watch people play the Pokemon games. It's fun to watch others 
not my type of game though personally so not something i would spend a lot of time invest a lot of time in playing and that's fine right we we all have games that we enjoy we all have games that we don't enjoy i don't hate on somebody because they like that just as i would hope that somebody doesn't hate on me because i happen to be enjoying enshrouded or valheim or like the flight sims or star citizen right like i'm not gonna sit here and dump on somebody because they like a game that i myself don't right it, it, again it comes down to like that that choice we're taking all of it oh we're getting the f at it yeah yeah Uh, I'm not exactly sh like where in the hell was this dude though? I guess man Mark of Smith Okay, well we got our I got my body back so that there's that oh my lord sweet Jesus uh, I don't think Mark of Smith, I you know what? I don't know what Marcus Smith is. If you like turds, that's fine. You're just a turd eater then. I mean, well, that's, that's kind of just it too, right? Like, oh, hey, look, it's a giant freaking pit mine. By the way, these guys are level 13. Just so we're clear, they're level 13. I am not. I am level seven. These things are, these guys are basically double my freaking level right now, okay? This is a problem. A big one. And we're going to avoid that problem. But beautiful thing is, I kind of have a better idea how to get around here now. So we're going to fast travel home because I need to repair. Hey, yeah, I took, yeah, no, screw that. They're dead. They don't need the, they don't need the loincloth. Loincloth is mine now. Spoils of victory. Hey. hey. Yes. Uh, test of skill. Okay. Your step is silent, your eyes determined. You've been on the hunt. I won't ask what bio, wild beasts you track, but your spoils are presentable at best. Try gathering some animal fur, then we can talk. Mm. What is that? Some sort of blight permeates every fiber. The skin is fibrous and porous, changed already. In the end, the shroud reaches all. Animal soldier king. All our bones crack the same. Here, I'll share my hunting rounds with you. I'll mark it in your journal, walk my trails, release my release them in my stead, Flameborn. Okay. Right. Uh, flame protection. Here we go. Flameborn, do you know why they call you that? You were forged from a sacrificial union between the ancients and humans. The ancient flame soul allows you to enter the shroud unharmed. But its glow doesn't last forever. With this power, you can rebuild the world no matter what. These people are well read. The word selection is noticeably not moronic. Strange. Wait, 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 wait. Like that. Good on you. You got some. You got some in your teeth. Okay. Well. Flameborn, I heard troubling rumors. Something horrible and grotesque is happening in the Springlands. An abomination. Abuse of the elixir. Please end this reign of terror before it's too late. All right, so we've got a couple of new locations added to the map. Uh, let's throw our animal skins and animal furs in there. Thank you. Uh, what else do I, I need? Salt. I don't have. See, I haven't done the salt stuff yet, but eh, that's fine. Okay. Well, look who's back. Lately, I can't help but wonder. The Vuka were always somber beasts bound to their caves, but they've been traveling east, aggravated. Perhaps this warrants an investigation. 
Maybe at their gathering location you can find some answers. It would help to know what they're up to. Okay, so we've got a couple of new locations. Uh, we're gonna add that. The nails right there. Um, let's see what we can do here. We're gonna put those in there. And I don't have anything. Nope. I have plenty of other items, but definitely gonna throw that in there though. The ruins, all of this stuff comes with me. Right, right, right. I need to start making more arrows. Uh, speaking of which, arrows, special arrows, flare arrow, copper poison, poison sack. Okay, so I need copper arrow. I don't have the ability to make copper arrows yet, dude. Shit, no. I don't. Damn it. Don't waste your Uh, oof. Chairs, benches, illumination. Don't need any of that crap. That means absolutely sweet diddly squat to me right now. Can't do anything oh, with any of that. All right, fair enough. They can like it, but I don't owe them my approval. Well, I don't owe anybody my approval just because they like something that I don't either. I'm just saying that it's, I'm not going to sit here and also talk crap about somebody who likes something that I don't happen to like, or I would hope that, you know, in, in the, sort of the same light that they wouldn't be sitting here talking crap about something that someone else likes that they don't like, you know what I mean? If that makes any sense whatsoever, uh, beats, okay. Yeah. Um, we've got that, so we're going to throw that up there. We're gonna throw that down there. I'm going to grab this. Uh, we'll throw that raw meat there. Actually, no. Do that first. Okay. Uh, yep. There's the wax. There's the wax. Okay, perfect. Oh, I still. Ooh. So that gives me plus three strength for 15 minutes, or plus. You know what? We're gonna. We're going to. No. Throw those in there. Jesus. Make up your mind, Dad. Come on, Dad. Come on, Dad. Need to build more of these larger. Um, Older to each, yeah, and that's that's kind of it. Like to each their own, right? Like if you if you enjoy doing something that somebody else doesn't enjoy, I mean, first and foremost, you know that that is for you. Enjoy what you enjoy, and that is fine. There's nothing wrong with that, as long as what you enjoy is not illegal or harming someone. You know what I mean? You're you are not doing harm to another per, uh, another person with what you are currently doing. Okay, I gotta stop collecting cloth for the time being. You know what? We're gonna get rid of that one single chunk of bone because I um, don't really need it. Throw that in there. Um, shroud liquid, yes. String, yes. Uh, I'm gonna need the critter parts, so I might as well throw those in there. That goes in there. The copper ore goes in there. Okay, the rest of this... Alright, so the only thing we've been able to retrieve so far is the mortar. This thing. Uh, I'm just gonna dump that and that and that and that and that in there. Okay. Hit the fire. Let's cook up some meat. Uh, do, 
do 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 Okay, we'll do that instead. You know what? That's true. I was mocked because I used to love doing uh, military, like plastic military models, like in 148 scale, 172 scale. I used to be mocked because I enjoyed reading comic books. I was mocked because of D&D, &D, and I was mocked because I liked stuff like model railroading. Whereas that, yeah, and that's the thing. Everything I can remember being mocked about as a kid or in high school is all mainstream and nobody gets mocked about it anymore. But again, I took that and I'm just because I had, I had that experience. I'm not going to then in turn mock someone else, right? I'm not going to in turn mock someone else because of what they like. Organic discovery. Yeah, pretty. Yeah, there was a lot of that. Like, I like that. I got none of that from school. <laughs> I got freaking harassed like a mother trucker in school because of my hobbies. And you know what? That's perfectly fine. I'm okay with that. I'm a big boy. It sucked as a teenager, but looking back at it now, I, I, I turned out perfectly fine because of it. I learned to I learned to cope best way to put it I learned to cope with people being assholes right so okay right I still oof Alchemist rumors. I'm not worried about the rumors though, but love letter to Jasmina Morwenna. We've already yeah. There's we still have the scavenger stash. We've so many things. I will. The one thing I am noticing though is they are definitely like they're they're spending time on this game. By the way, chat. They have been already spending time on this Uka ceremony cinder vault mark of Smith. uh we have a flame shrine I wish that the flame shrines instead of being set as a waypoint was something that you could actually like fast travel to That being said, I'm just going to sit here for a quick moment. What I'm going to do is I've got to use the bathroom. Okay, so we're going to grab a short break. We've been live for three and a half hours. I have not taken a break yet. I'm going to get up. I'm going to use the bathroom. I'll meet you back here in a few minutes. Get up, grab a snack, get something to drink. Meet me back here in a few. Okay.
Hello, chat. Hello. All right, folks, we're back. All right, feel a little bit better after having a bit of a break. Let's get, uh, there we go. And big old health, make some health increase. All right, well rested. Uh, let's, let's see about that. Let's get that well rested bonus up and Right, so I still have stuff to retrieve. I don't know how the hell I'm gonna get that stuff out of the freaking um, out of the shroud, like the the dangerous shroud, as it were. Because as you guys can see, my death marker is right there. That's where the tombstone is, and I do not know how the hell I'm gonna get my stuff out of there. That's kind of the awkward. That's the awkward part. I don't know how I'm getting my stuff back. Like, God damn it. Uh, we are gonna continue with the club though, cause you know, club life. Yo, Willow Crush, chat. Oh, okay, fine. Roommate's home. I mean, it's dog. You you might hear the dog all of a sudden just start going. <laughs> yep. <laughs> the dog uh, tends to get a little excited when my roommate gets home. But again, also her dog or his dog. I mean, so you know, her. It, it, her. It, it, it's his dog. Hmm. These are weird, by the way. I don't know how I feel about this. What are these bundles? What the fuck is this? All right, you know what? What is that? It's just woodlock. Oh, F that. Seems like a big old waste right there, doesn't it? All right. Um. Uh, I am very curious as to what the mechanism for this is. deadly oh wow um okay uh right well that answered the question of whether or not we're gonna Ooh, shit no that is definitely a big old no oh god damn it what is in there that's where my body is, by the way, chat. Okay, bye, Zool. Um, I messaged you, I DM'd you on Facebook, by the way. I like that disowned! <laughs> no! What, what do you mean? My stuff, what, the dog's been disowned or my stuff has been disowned? My stuff could very well be disowned. At this point, I might very well be screwed, too. My stuff... Yeah, I guess my stuff might be disowned. Um... Hmm... What? There is so much of it! 
Oh, there's got it. Chat. Mm. Right, so the deadly shroud is really bad. We've got like the time just you got seconds. You get in there and it's like you go from having minutes to seconds. It's wowza. So the real object is how do we get a stuff back? Yeah, instead instead of having minutes, we only have seconds. <laughs> Listen here, sir. If I could climb a tree, wait a minute. Mm, hold on. I have an idea, but I need to get to the other side of um, where we are here, which is Willow Crush. Cause there's that locate. Oh, Jesus. Whoa. That's not dangerous at all. Okay, so I found landmines. Awesome. Love it. That's fantastic. We've got mines here. I'm, I'm trying to be stealthy, okay? Shh. Dad's trying to be stealthy. I'm being very stealthy. Very sneaky. Y'all want to come down here? That's fine. Let's jam. Come on, boo boo. At least I don't have to worry about that wall getting knocked down now. It's already out of the. The wall's already been taken out of the, out of the picture. If I come around this corner and these mother truckers are coming down here, I'm gonna die. No, okay, we good, we good, we're good, we're good. Sorry, sorry. Okay, come on. I mean, they can chase me down now, but it ain't gonna do them much good. Ah, oh, come. Are you seriously? Not mean to do that. New. Okay. We got a chest there. Yo, copy. How you doing? Valheim sucks. Graphics are dog poop. I mean, 
you, you can say that, I guess, but considering how many people bought it, you do realize that that visual aesthetic was done purposely, though. And that's fine. That, 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 I, I personally, I thoroughly enjoy the game. I thoroughly enjoy it, but you know, I know it's not for everybody. I love the building. I love the gameplay. The modability just opens it up to so much. And I, again, like it comes back to the what we were we were actually talking about this earlier, where not everything is everyone's cup of tea, right? And that's okay. Not everything has to be everyone's cup of tea. Oh shit! Oh, I'm I'm in danger. Chad, I'm in. Dad's in danger. I am in danger. But it was never meant to be like ultra realistic either, right? That's that's the other thing I think a lot of people sometimes forget is it was never meant for that. So sometimes, so it's again, it's it. So Valheim is one of those games that initially at the very start I didn't like it either. It took time. I had to grow into it, right? So this entire valley is a freaking problem, chat. You're seeing this, right? Like, my... This entire valley is just death. Oh! Nope. I know a lot of people bought it because they thought it was going to be like visually freaking gorgeous and it can be but again modded right oh it's free on game pass okay so here's here's now here's the issue with the game pass version compared to buying it on steam game pass version as far as i know cannot be modded now I might be incorrect on that, but as far as the information used to be, um, like up, like even a year ago was the Game Pass version could not be modded. The console version cannot be modded. The version that you purchase through Steam can be. Woo, there we go. Got away from the bees real quick, didn't we? Flame sanctum. Wait, we found it. We did. We found another flame sanctum chat. Collecting that spark. Ooh, we got two out of that. Nice. I'll take some wax. I'm all right with that. Let's go. Fired brick. <gasps> oh, let's go. Yeah. Yeah. All right. What do we got? It crawls beneath my flesh. I feel its teeth in my flesh evermore. The first bite was but bitter prelude to many more that followed. I fear my time is near. My muscles tighten. My skin stretches. I can see them under candlelight, eagerly pushing outward. The catacomb has cursed me, for the hollow of my ribcage is home to a thousand dying bites. Woo! That does not sound like a good time. Chat survival flask. That doesn't sound like a good time to me, chat. I don't know about you, but definitely does not sound like a good time to me. Salt. Salt. Yeah. Sorry. Sorry. More salt. There we go. Perfect. All the salt. All the time. 
Right, so that flame sanctum has now officially been completed. Our tombstone is there. I still need to figure out how to get to the other goddamn side here. Without going through the Marcus Sameth. Because F that place. Well, the, so another thing, uh, another point, at least for me anyways, another point that was in uh, Valheim's, um, in Valheim's uh, court for me was the, the fact that it was, um, it was completely randomized seeds, right? Similar to Minecraft. So the world generation and everything was completely random, right? Like it was fully randomized. So there was something about that too that further drew me to that game. And again, you know, it comes back to, to, to each their own. And if you don't like it, you don't like it. And that's fine. And, you know, nobody's going to hold it against you if you don't enjoy something that, some, uh, that other people do. But the thing is, though, is you at least tried it. So that's something else to note. Proc gen is usually thin by nature, hard to, well. Yeah, there is that. Sometimes procedural generation can be a little, can be a little lackluster. Ah, oh, I don't think so there, sir. Okay, what do we got going on up here, though? Oh, shit! Jesus! Taking the bones, don't need the bones. Bones don't do nothing for. Ooh, ooh, that looks dangerous. That looks dangerous. Ow, mother trucker! Oh shit! Holy shit, that thing hurts. I'm dying. Chat, I'm in danger. We're in danger. My body. That. You know what? The fact that they're dying all on their own and I'm not doing anything, I am okay with this. <laughs> that just makes my life so much easier. Y'all want to keep jumping over that gorge and dying? I mean, you want to unalive yourselves? Go right ahead. I'm not going to tell you you can't. Go right ahead, unalive yourself in the video game, okay? Oh shit, nope. Oh, that is a terrible idea. How about we try this instead? Backpack. Let's throw that in. Number three, so I can see. Here we go. Oh, sweet Jesus. Where the hell did these guys come from? Huh. 
You know, the fact that there's technically factions is nice. I'm okay with this. This works for me. In dead oh fuck that. In dead how oh come on. I can't even cross here? Bruh. That's some deep bullshit. How am I supposed to get across the hole, chat? Oh. I'm what the fuck? Come on, man. I need a cross there. Why are we shame? Why am I? Why? What? 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 What's with the? What? Why? Why are we shaming me? Huh? Sir, didn't appreciate your bullshit to begin with. Holy crap! This shit is everywhere. It's everywhere. It's everywhere. Right, so I can't touch this in any way, shape, or form. This sucks. Those things are super territorial. <laughs> So I can actually whack things with my uh, torch, which is interesting, but not something I'm going to want to try on a full on regular basis either. Ooh, nope. No. Oh, God damn it. Okay. Well, no, that's fine. Oh, come on. in the dark not as easy as it looks take the skins cuz the fur yeah it is not easy to do this in the dark but again we've got a that no nope, no nope. uh, I mean I'll take we'll take the forest beets cuz the forest beets are are useful we can make some vegetable soup with it oh where in the hell are the bats coming from yo No, nope. We're gonna, we're gonna just no. Dad is gonna get rid of that. That is, that is gross. That is nasty. I want no part of that. Apparently, they came out of the hole. Oh, it is actually legit. Hmm. I see. There's a cave here. Yeah. Nerp. A whole lot of freaking bats coming out of goddamn underground hole. Hmm. I can't go. How far? What? There's. Oh man, I can't believe that there's no way across this chasm. 
without backtracking, I'm not going through the Mark of Cement. That is such a pain in the balls. Oof. Oi. God damn it. We are a long ass way from home, by the way. Just for the record. Long way from home. Um. I need Oswald Anders' chest. We need the building blocks. I need to reclaim the wilderness. And we need Rumble and the Cat. Like, we need. Oh, oh, there's so much stuff. Yeah, so if you're wondering, yes, I'm currently standing on top of a block here because I'm waiting for morning. Uh, I'd rather not try to engage activities in the dark when I can not see a whole lot because let's let's face it listen nighttime in this game is like nighttime it, it you're just yeah, what Co coffee really sir <laughs> Now, sir, that was a hole in the ground. God damn it. All right, uh, you know, I kind of wish we had a clock. I'd like to know what time it is. Not real world, but you know, in game, I'd like a game time. So, I did get a Logitech wheel and pedals for ATS. Now, I need the Obi to Toby eye tracker. Hold on, what, what, what are we at? Uh, okay. Okay, come on. Can, can Dad have morning? What? We're just gonna sit down for a second. Sit. No. Sitting? Yeah. That's not working. Okay. Oh. Jesus. Everything out here is trying to murder me right now. Oh, God damn it. Jesus Christ. Oh, there's two of you bozos. Oh, and that's special. I'm not fighting two of you in the dark. Woo. Damn near wet myself. There is a cave somewhere here. Let's let's try some. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna cheese this, okay? Okay, chat. That's gonna cheese this. That does not do a whole lot of freaking damage, okay? That's, I'm just gonna be honest about this. Not do a whole lot of damage. Oh Jesus! Nope, that didn't work. Sure didn't. Holy <laughs> shit! Run! Well, that didn't work. I'm going to end up falling to my death because I'm not going to be able to see where in the hell I go. There is great. Awesome. Giant freaking wolf somewhere. We can't go in there because that is. Oh, shit. I am. Nope. Oh, Lord. Ow. Damn it. You know what? You stay in your hole, you son of a bitch. Freaking hell. Finally, daylight. I can see what the hell we're doing. Take the resin. Shroud liquid. Okay. Yeah, 
here. Here. Nothing. Okay, well, we we survived another night. I don't really know how because we shouldn't have, but we did. We're still here. I like that. Sorry, I made a no-no. You don't have to tell us when you do a number two. It's okay. No. Oh! Oh, oh shit. Okay, well, let this sort of... We're gonna get a little bit of rest bonus here. Dr. Evil, listen number two. One billion dollars. Like we should probably get up to about 10 minutes and then we'll be done. Yep, there we go. Okay. I mean, this is uh, you know, you could you could definitely defend yourself up here. I'm surprised the wolf was out here, but fuck me, that is huge. Good lord, man. Oh, that's stinging net, all right. I think so. Yep. Okay. Yep, I'm avoiding the goddamn. We are avoiding nature right now. Because those plants can suck a giant bag of freaking weenus. All the weenus. You know what? We're 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 gonna we're gonna commit a war crime, okay? We're committing a war crime. Nineteen epic. Holy, holy crap. Ooh. So this one here is legendary. It's a level seven. This one here is a level 11 and it's only an epic. Oh, this one is epic too. You know what? We're gonna, we're gonna swap that out. Uh, this one is fully upgraded, but we're going to seven. There we go. All right. We are going to equip that one. Hey, uh, we're going to delete that. What the hell? We're going to delete that too. I don't know why we've got that. It is what it is. Uh, is this deadly shroud or is it just shroud shroud? In Shrouded. Okay, this is just regular old-fashioned trap. It's not the deadly crap that we've been dealing with down in that freaking gully there, because the game absolutely 100% detests us. And it's trying to murder us and doesn't want us to have any fun at all in any way, shape, or form. It just gets bigger and bigger. Holy crap. Well, we found another flame shrine, so we're going to collect that. Thank you. Another two sparks. Oh, boy. Uh, uh no. Don't really know what to expect, so we're just going to take it Kinda easy coming down here, cause I don't know. Oh, ores. 
Is that what? Yep. Boars. Okay, well, those boars can go and F off. We're going to avoid them. Come around. We're going to come around a long way, chat. Come through here. We're going to take the... We're going to take... There's a path? Well, 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 well. Oh shit, ow! Actually, you know what? No. Wrong. Freaking bees. Well, we can get the table saw at least, so that's a start. Right, how let us get the table saw. Oh my. Oh, this is bad. Jesus. Uh, yeah, we'll take that. I'm going to take the wolf meat. Take the scrap metal and the cloth. All right, let's go. So far, so good. Oh, I mean, you know what? No, you're in a cage. Fuck you. <laughs> you can stay in your cage, bud. I'm not letting you out, man. Not letting you out of your cage. You can stay in there. Whatever you did to deserve to, to get thrown into that cage is probably on you, and that is your own damn fault. I am not saving your ass. I'm not here on a mission of mercy. I am here to find a table saw. Where we shall find said table saw, I'm not quite certain, but we're gonna attempt to uh, be sneaky about this, okay? I'm gonna try not to. Attract too much unwanted attention here, if possible. This, uh, da, 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 da. Oh, we snuck in through the back door, so that's something. Take the scrap metal. A lot of scrap. Take it. Take all of it. Nothing down here? Really? I mean, fine. A little disappointed, I'm not gonna lie. A little shocked as well, dismayed even. Okay, uh, we are... Uh, no. Open, please. Hatchet level 11. 26 damage. Alright, uh, that should technically. Uh, yeah, we're, we're swapping that out. Hells yes. 100% can confirm swapping it out.
Okay, so... We're currently here. We have so many freaking quests. So that's the one that's active. Thornfold, Thornhold has fallen to scavengers. The town has been looted. There are no circular saw blades to be found. Perhaps there are clues nearby. Location. Show on map. Ah, all right. So. That as a waypoint. Okay. Let's get the hell out of here then. You know what? We got, we got an upgraded axe, so I'm all right with this. Oh, I have no idea what you are, and I don't want to know. Nope. Sure don't. Sure don't want to know what you are or who you are. You can just go back into your little town over there, and that is perfectly okay for me. I have no... Logitech, hey, get the buyer's protection. Yeah, unfortunately. As I, as I actually made a statement earlier in the stream today um, to another community member, say you're, you're at, the, we are at a point now that Logitech and Thrustmaster should not even be names that are considered when you're looking to buy a wheel. Full stop. Shouldn't even be a consideration. Uh, look to Moza or Fanatec. And those, that's, that's where you should be getting your, uh, your wheels. Your wheels should be coming from either Moza or Fanatec. And if it takes, you know, two months to save up a couple extra dollars and so be it kind of thing. If that makes any sense to anyone. Uh, hi. Oh yeah, this axe is definitely going to do the job. Let's go. Well, yeah, or you, you end up spending 300 to get a plastic piece of crap. Uh, and then you end up like two years later having to spend another, you know, 800 to get a decent wheel, you know. And it's unfortunate, but it's also very true. This, this is where we're at with regards to stuff like this. Um... Or wait six months. Yeah, or wait six months to get warranty. Yeah. Or not be able to RMA it at all. Investigate the roads around Thorn. Okay. Oh, come on then. Come on, bud. You and me, bud. is putting in the work. What is that? Eh. We'll take that. We'll take that. We'll take that. We'll take that, but I'm breaking that down for its components, because F that. Salvage. Yep, there we go. Okay. In the scavenger camp? Okay, looks like we're heading up to the scavenger camp. Huh? 
At least we don't have too far to go. Bossong Frontier, huh? Oh! Definitely putting in some work. New axe putting in the work. Uh, great grappling. Could have turned out way worse than it did, Chad. <laughs> Holy shit. I mean, I will gladly take the copper arrows. Thank you. must reach the sky. Build higher. The tower must reach the zenith and rival the grace of the sun itself. Matron Leandra demands so. I've procured the finest castle stone. Find plenty of it behind the tower. Only the best for Matron Leandra. I see. He's like that, is it? Uh, can't... You know, I keep forgetting that there is a stealth component to this. That if I wanted to be, I could legitimately just be a goddamn assassin and just run around and freaking murk people from the shadows. And yet, here we are, constantly just fumbling around like a bear cub with two dicks. Not quite sure what to do with which one. Or why. Nando had three. Well, that's interesting. Didn't know that. Mm. <laughs> Mr. Garibaldi. <laughs> ah, here we go. Mr. Garibaldi. Ah, uh, yes. Good old B5. By the way, um, two slider. They had three? Really? I didn't know that. Um, Slider. Veer had a whole sp Oh, right, about using one, two, or three. Right, I forgot about that. Um, have you by any chance seen the animated Babylon 5? There's a, an hour long. Animated. Uh, it came out in tw last year, 2023. Oh, Jesus! I don't know who that is. I don't want any... No, no, we, we have this shit. No, no, we are out. Oh, hell no. Whoa! Excuse me, sir.
Don't mind fucking off for a minute. Thanks. Okay, thanks. I mean, don't tell me it's ineffective. That man's is dead. Baseball. Oh, that didn't work worth a shit, did it? Nope. Too far away. Too far away, chat. How many of these? I've got seven of these things left. Motherfucker. Holy hell. Okay, um. Yo, nearby. Hello. Sorry for bothering you. Uh, you know what? You know what? Hey. Um. Yeah, uh. You know what? I'm uh, I'm gonna have to tell you to go. No. Yeah. Um. Uh, somebody wanna work. Okay, first of all, somebody wanna report the bot. Thank you. Appreciate it. Some bad boilerplate. That is a bot. And they're gone. Bye bye now. Seems better fit with animated. It can inter Well, and that's the thing. So they got Box Lightner to uh, reprise the. He did the voice work for uh, Sh Sheridan. Um. Apparently, uh, it, it again. It's currently only available for purchase or rent on Amazon. Bot fuse boilerplate. I mean, why not, right? I say. Boilerplate. Boilerplate. Uh, where did the campfire thing go? Because I'm going to get rid of it. We're going to delete that. Thank you. What that? Did I use the health potion? I apparently did. Flask of the Fell. Apparently I did. I uh, apparently very much used the freaking thing. There are a lot of bodies down there right now, by the way. 
Uh, I don't know if you guys noticed that or, uh, or not, but... Oh my god! Sweet Jesus! Oh. oh lord! Oh, we are in a bad place! Very bad spot! Nope! We're in a bad spot! Shit! Woo! Oh, this, no, we're in danger. This is terrible. This is a bad idea. All the way around. Holy shit. Oh, God. Good Lord. Nope. Nope, that, that, that is all bad. All of it is bad. It's all bad. Terrible idea. Jesus Christ. Woo! Yeah, he has two. He's too unique. Was. Ship it. <laughs> ship it. Well, they got shipped all right. I shipped him the F out of here. All right. Uh, do, do, ba, do, ba, do. Okay, listen, I just, okay, all I need, you know what I need? It, I just need the saw, I need the circular blades, saw blades, that's all. I just need the saw blades from the camp, okay? Y'all don't have to give me such a freaking bitch ass time about it. Just let me get the damn saw blades. Oh! Oh, shit. That's not gonna work for me. Well, we were able to do this before. Jesus! <laughs> Jesus. Hey! This root beer has 85% of my sugar for the day. Jesus. Yeah. That's, that's... And, and people wonder why I don't drink a whole lot of soda. Or very often. <laughs> why it is not a regular part of my diet. No! God damn it! How did I... I have then as like... I have them as like special... Yeah, that is definitely a special dessert. Oh, it's one of the nice ones with the real sugar. Oh, I'll see. That's not so bad. No! Oh, shit. Woo! Let's go! Okay. Mission complete. Let's get the hell out of here. Oh no, bro. We out. <laughs> I got what I needed. We are the fuck out of here. Hells yeah. Dad got what he needed. All right. Oh, thank God. Because that means I can do this. <laughs> I can just go, hey, you know what I can do now? Test the skill. I, list. I don't care about the test the skill right now. Uh, we're going back home. Yeah. I don't do corn syrup. Fat sauce. Cancer up 70% 70, 70 under 50. The corn syrup. <laughs> Yo, corn syrup generation, chat. That's right. That's right. You heard it right here, right now. The old corn syrup generation. Mm -hmm. Okay, so it's sleepy time. A little bit of Betty Bye time. Here we go. I love my chocolate well corn. Mmm, corn chocolate. Or is that chocolate dip corn? Hi. We can now craft the circuit. Hey, look at that. We need 10 nails, four, and eight logs. Okay. 
All right, we are definitely getting to a point where dad needs to start looking at, uh, okay, well, we're gonna get rid of that. Uh, nope, we're gonna throw all of the scrap metal in here. Boom, done. Uh, actually, no, let's take some of this. Uh, well, let's take some of those, cause I think I need nails. Uh, yeah, let's, let's. Right, okay, that works. So wood can only stack in 250. All right, good to know. Uh, poison sack, I do not see any poison sack or anything in here. No, 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 no. Right. Uh, have the nails. We need more wood logs. Fine. Okay, hold on. Just calm your... Jeez. Oh, no. It's chocolate with corn. Ooh, chocolate with corn in it. Well, how about that? That sounds absolutely delicious. What a flavor monstrosity you created. Done and dusted. Table saw. Now we can make uh, uh, some uh, nicer wood. Okay. Throw those in there. Yeah, sure, why not? We'll actually take that metal scrap. We're gonna take it and we're gonna put it back in here because we don't need it now. And as for the table saw, we are going to... Holy shit, that thing is huge. Did you guys happen to... Jesus, chat. Wood planks. What do we need? For wood planks, we just need wood logs. Alright, that's, you know, that's that's easy enough. Let's do that. Let's give them some wood logs. Let's go. Throw that in there. Put that in there. And off to the races it goes. All the planks. All planks all the time. Alright, let's... We have, we don't have flint. Um, why do I have, you know what? I need, I'm probably gonna need that plant fiber anyways. We're gonna throw, nope, 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 nope. Uh, that and that. We're just gonna destroy that for now because we don't actually need that. I have 13 freaking sparks though, like holy Hannah. Okay, that I can dump in here. Put, where's the resin? There's resin. Okay, 47. And hello, ma'am. How are you? Put the wax in there. Um, beets. Yes, there we go. Beets. Uh, seeing nettle, I don't have, but... Okay, that will go in there. Perfect. right -o. So many things collected, and I don't know what to do. Canosian corn bra... Yeah, they call it Betus of Fetus. Canosian corn bribes. With no corn subsidy, it would barely exist. I mean, you know, hey, what, you got a problem with the, the corn bribes? Why are we shitting on the poor Canosians, huh? What did they, what did they do? How did, how did they hurt you, sir? How did the Canosians hurt you? Let's throw that in there. 2021 most recent subsidies were five billion one hundred fifty eight million six hundred twenty two thousand in the United States for Kansas Holy sh Nikes, that's a lot That is a lot That is a ridiculous amount I have five billion reasons why 
Uh, I hate the libs in return. <laughs> uh-huh. That's why we stay away from politics, because most people would have just automatically assumed that you weren't being, you know, it would take you as being serious with that. We know how that goes. Factual statement on numbers. Even though we both understand, we both know, it wouldn't matter. Lock made a fired brick has a dull coal. We both know it wouldn't matter. The matter who's running the show, it's all bullshit. <laughs> Well, there is that. Thanks. So, if we have planks, what does that mean? We do 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 do. Boop 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 ba do boop do 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 do. We need two metal sheets, two wood planks, and eight nails for one of these medium chests. Holy shit! It'll fail for corn always full. If it's used, like if it, so here, something that we do with corn up here is it's actually used um, for uh, the creation of ethanol. Um, yep, I'm just gonna, yep, we're just gonna delete it. Yep, delete it, okay. Okay, so something tells me that for whatever reason, it seems that these rings are being recognized as equipped when they're not. There's a reason we're doing this. Just bear with me for a quick moment here. So what I don't understand, Captain Arkwright is engraved, given to the most loyal of commanders. Yeah, well, I totally understand that, but... Weird chat. Shippy getting weird. All right, and now I should be able to pull that one out of there and put it into there. Yes. Okay, that's better. Uh, we'll throw that down there, that down there, and grab that and put that 
right there. Okay, perfect. Beautiful. All right, now we're getting somewhere. Now, now we're starting to cook. I haven't seen ethanol. Ethanol is still used in uh, fuel manufacture up here. That's primarily what corn goes to up here. I know it's a little weird. It's a little strange, but hey, there you have it. Okay, so we've got that done. And last but not least, we're gonna cook up this. Yule raw game, chat. We're gonna cook up Yule raw game. It's no longer raw, it is now grilled. Folks, if you're just joining us, welcome. I'm your host, Scott. This is the arcade. Happy Monday. It's the start of a new week. And uh, we got a lot of. A lot of enshrouded to get through. Um, that being said, Tuesdays and Thursdays are still going to be Valheim. Thursday this week, we are going to be joined Thursday afternoon by Zaul. So she's taking time to join us in game in in Valheim on Thursday to for stream. So I'm looking forward to it. We're actually going to get her camera set up and working so we can add her in. One more, let's go. Right. Uh, do I? So I want that to go there because that's too. Yeah, that's that's better. All right, and that should be able to. That'll go there, yep, and that does nothing. Shiza. Balls, bullocks. We'll throw that in there temporarily. Do we have what I'm looking for? We do perfect ornate bed frame plus 14 more at the carpenter. Holy shit, man. Right, um, beds. Damn. Double damn. Ooh, it's polished. Ah, uh, we need hot. Ooh. Ooh, it's a polished table. That's very nice. Polished wooden bedside table. Mutable! Long time no see, how you been? Been a hot second, I'm doing well. Good to see you. Man, oh man, we are getting, ooh. We're getting, getting into some really nice stuff here. Damn. I has been whooping your ass? I mean, unfortunately, sometimes that happens and it sucks when it does, but. Really, truly does suck when it does. Miscellaneous, huh? Wooden crate. Wooden barrel. Wood logs, nails, tar. We do not have tar. Carved wooden double door. Metal... That is a beautiful log, oh, god damn. Cupboards. Shelves. Holy shit. Man, the building is just getting better and better. Wooden bucket. Right, okay, uh... An improved storage option with enhanced capacity. The items stored here can be used for crafting purposes from anywhere in the base. Everything been good? I mean, 
I'm here, I'm still alive, I've been doing some co-op stuff in a variety of different games, uh, you know, yeah, we're doing good. Still, still able to kind of pay some bills when, you know, and such, so I would say, yeah, we're doing all right. Okay. Storage. Wood planks, nails, metal sheet. Uh, of course I need the metal sheet. Of course we need the metal. Well, we'll just, uh, how many of these can I make? Okay. How many can we make? One. I don't have enough of those. Do we have enough left? Ah, oh, we do! Look at this! Excuse me, sir. I would very much like to make another one of these, please. Thank you. Beautiful. You are absolutely incredible, sir. Thank you. So, here's what we're gonna do. Here's what I propose, chat. So you see, life has been kicking your ass. I feel as though this requires a little bit more of an explanation as to specifically how has life been kicking your ass. Okay, let's, uh... Damn, that is a lot of storage space. Okay, uh, so we're gonna... We're gonna take all. There we go. Well, yeah, I kind of figured you'd be out of school by this point. Okay, there we go. Pick that up. Actually, we're gonna pick that up as well. And then we're going to go here. And we're gonna grab the, that one. It's a tiny. We're gonna delete that. Thank you. Right, seven. This in the corner here. I mean, that's kind of it, right? Life just has a tendency of kicking you repeatedly in the balls, whether you like it or not. Man, that is a lot of storage space. Okay, uh, that fixes so many things now. Let's go. Okay, so we're gonna... Yep. Uh, pick that up, that up, that up, that up, that up. No, no, I'll just never mind. Okay, uh, we we have alleviated some storage issues here, chat. Okay, so that is just so much nicer now. All right. Um. So here's what we're gonna do. Uh, here's what I propose. We're gonna put those back in there because I don't currently need them. We're gonna put those back in there. Not carrying those around. And we are going to take. Actually, no, I'll leave that one for now. Let's come in here and do this one. Okay, pick that one up. goodies can go in here uh-huh yo coffee thank you so much for the hundred biddies appreciate that guess we'll see how long I last in manufacturing Man like the thing is though is what specifically are you doing in manufacturing I guess is a better better question that thank you so much coffee appreciate that okay 
right, so... Ah! Actually, we're gonna do that. Right. Okay. Okay. Right, right, right. Lockpicks. Process engineering, making cardboard Amazon boxes. Um. Process engineering just kind of sounds like a fancy way of saying that, uh. Is it? Here's the thing it doesn't sound like engineering, though. It just sounds like you're responsible for making sure that the machine doesn't get stuck as it's spitting out boxes. I, I could totally be reading that wrong, too. Non-mechanical engineering engineering. And that and that. That come down here. Okay, that's the heel channel. Yep, spark. Ice bolt, right. Fire and the prayer of the flames. There you go. Okay. Flask of the fell. That opens up so much more space. Went chemical engineering to process engineering. Oh. Oh. I see. All right, so um, this one here, for the time being, I'm just going to leave as is. All right. What are we doing on the... Still churning away. Like that, let's make something grand, the man says. Listen here, Bobby. Actually, hold on. Wait. Hold on. What do we got in here? What are, what's our comfort level in here? 13. Okay, well. Definitely got some... Definitely got a... Hands-on engineering is good for spotting new process, patent, smart item, retire. The thing is, though, is generally, um, if you get hired on under contract, anything that you... You don't get to keep... You don't get to patent anything. If you come up with an idea or a process while you're working for said company, that company actually owns your idea. Because you came up with it on their time. You came up with it while you were in their employee. Employee. So the whole thing behind smarting a, a like patent smart item, unfortunately, doesn't exist for a lot of people who work for a company doing that anymore. Company to company for certain uh, for certain something to watch for. I mean, patent sticks for the company. Yeah, we're still signed, paid out on it. Natural employer owns it. Yeah, but you know what I mean, right? Like. You know, there there is always the possibility you could like again, I'm and that's how you get to keep keep that's how you keep get thought leaders. True, but not uh, remember there are a lot of employers who do not look at it like that either. Unfortunately, right? Like work made for hire is the legal term. Really? Work made for hire. Interesting. I did not know that. Um, chat. Thanks for hanging out with me. I appreciate the hell out of you. You guys are awesome. Also, I'm really loving this game. Enshrouded? Such a good game. I'm really, really thoroughly enjoying this game. Um, tomorrow, Tuesday. So Tuesdays and Thursdays. For those of you that don't know, Tuesdays and Thursdays is Valheim. Has been Valheim for the better part of a month now. Specifically, Tuesdays and Thursdays. Monday, Friday, Wednesday, or Monday, Wednesday, Friday, blah, words are hard. I tend to play whatever game on that I'm really into. Um, lately, it has been enshrouded. Before that, we were doing Star Citizen. We're probably going to be going back to Star Citizen soon. As much as I'm enjoying enshrouded, it is one of those, you know, go back to something that I, I, I know I've got a lot of time in and I have actually been in short, uh, you know, really truly enjoying the game as well. But running a paper machine is what I'm doing full time, uh, full time and it's, and it's been 
And all it's been is getting caught up to speed. I got you. I got you. The old stock chair, right? Otherwise, people wouldn't innovate. Why bother? Stock chair. It's sort of the same daily as a passive viewer in Valheim shrouded. Yeah, well, there you go. Right? Anyway. Uh, chat, thanks for being here. Thanks for dropping follows. Thank you so much for the subs and resubs and gifted subs and the bits and the tips. As always, just the tip. Because, you know. Oh, my. You never go all in and all deep. Uh, again, tomorrow, Valheim, we're going to pick up where we left off. I have a new building that I've been working on that I need to complete and get things moved over uh, so I can sort of reorganize the whole base logistics of everything for Thursday because Ool will be joining us on Thursday for Valheim again. So I'm looking forward to that chat. Have yourselves a wonderful Monday evening. I'll see you back here for tomorrow's stream. I'm going to see if I can find someone to raid. If you guys would be nice and hang around for a couple of minutes, we'll see if we can find somebody to send you over to and give a little bit of love. And uh, you know what? I know I know where I'm going to send you. I know where I'm going to send you. Okay? I know exactly where I'm sending you, chat. Uh, we are going to go and raid Quirk. We haven't, uh, we haven't raided Quirk in a little bit. Uh, Quirk is currently working at the Hyper P1. <laughs> Holy shit. Yeah, so he's, he's, um... Uh, Quirk is currently messing around in iRacing. So I'm going to send you guys over to Quirk's Eyes. I'll catch you all back here tomorrow for Tuesday's stream. Have a wonderful Monday night, everyone. Cheers.